<laughs> What's I'm he sorry. saying now? What's he saying, saying now? <laughs> what? What shit is he talking? <laughs> Okay. 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 So. <laughs> now that so. that is all solved on my end, I apologize for that. I thought that all that was done, and apparently I goofed and didn't save the map. So I had to recreate <laughs> it. Oh, which sucked. Mm -hmm. All right. I totally didn't do that while I was at work today. Um... Nah, not at all. Uh, so, last session, we finally had dinner. Yay, um, dinner. <laughs> you guys had your dinner with Strahd, um, and met uh, a few of the residents of the castle. Um, after having been forcefully brought there via carriage. Um... And Harrigan got to find out what he is, or at least what they call him. Yeah. Um, and the uh, party was then let go, and they were brought back to Velaki. Uh, they were then let back into the tavern um, to a very tense uh, meeting with the Rare Raven folk. Um, with Harrigan nearly getting attacked until <laughs> Von Richten interjected and knocked the person unconscious. After being able to explain themselves a little bit more in detail, uh, rather than at the end of a sword, the Were Ravens mm -hmm. agreed to continue their friendship and their partnership with the party after asking for forgiveness for threatening them. Uh, and the party agreed. Uh, the night went on, uh, drinks were had, music, and the party then retired to their rooms after some one-on-one -on -one conversations with everyone or with a few people anyway the party slept woke up the next morning that is where we pick off after Zila having a terrible night uh, of nightmares Mm-hmm. Okay. And having a woken... Good morning. <laughs> yes. Uh, and all of you meet back downstairs. So, feel free for the... I know that we had a little bit of roleplay as far as the cousins oh. and Drosta, uh, but feel free to have any uh, additional sorts of RP from the other characters that now see uh, everyone come downstairs and noticeably see uh, Zila be quite tired. Well, I'll get the ball rolling, I guess. Don't everybody <laughs> jump at once. Right. So. <laughs> Uh, Zila will go sit down and just wait for 
breakfast to be served quietly, not really making eye contact with anyone. Are you hungover? Did we drink that much last night? I didn't drink. I'm still no. gonna make my weird Vistani hangover cure. <laughs> Fair. Put it in front of you. <laughs> You're putting it in front of Zila? Right yeah, it's now? for you. <laughs> D, D, uh, uh, Zila, Zila will slash look D at it and just Zila? look at you and go, I don't think this is going to fix my problem. I don't know what helps me or not. Well, what's your problem? Zila will now start drinking it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, well, fine then. Fuck me, I guess. Calm down. <laughs> and I go back to eating my breakfast. Hey, I hey, see. question, question, yes. DM. Um, for Zila slash DM. Um, mm -hmm. has Zofi ever? Has this happened to Zila since Zofi's been with her? Like, pre not to this start? extent. Not to okay. this extent. Okay. Good to, you know. Would, Good to know. You would have seen her have bad nights, but not not nearly this bad. Okay. Um Zila, are you okay? Um you seem a bit off. Ooh. No, I'm fine. At 19. Zila, you She's know clearly I... not fine. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you know I... Mind link. You know I can tell when you're lying, right? We've been traveling long enough. Mind link back to uh, Zofi. There. What do you want me to say? That I. That I'm not fine? It's not gonna change anything. I wanna know what's hap. What's wrong? T talk to me. What's going on? I don't. Okay, so for this session. Sophie, you would have known already. Sophie would have known already, Chris. Right, sorry. I forgot. Did we learn at the end of last session? Yes. For some reason, I thought we did. Yeah, we were in. For the some room. reason, I thought you didn't share it. Yeah, you no. guys were in right, the room. Right. Right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I don't didn't have that in the end of my notes here. That's my bad. So, would you like to change how this conversation's going? <laughs> 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 I'm giving Foot you a free mouth. restart. I, I'm, I'm giving you a free restart, sir. <laughs> it's just, it's foot and foot and mouth. It's fine. Okay, so what does Zofi say now? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Z playing off of Zofi saying that Zila can talk to her about anything. And this will be in the mind mind link um hold on uh, yeah Zofie said oh to it anyways Z Zila will say back to Zofie in regards to the talking to her about anything I know I can't I just I don't know if I should. Just... I need time to think. Okay, alright. Uh, well... If it gets worse, let us know. Um... We're not exactly going into... Friendly... Territory. We haven't been in friendly territory. 
You know, this whole play. Well, I mean, the castle wasn't bad. I wouldn't call that friendly. I'd call it safe, given the circumstances. I wouldn't even call that safe. Well... For what it's worth, we were under his protection, so no one was going to fuck with us until that was done. Small victories. I just... <sighs> I understand. I just... I need... I need to think about how to handle this. Right. Um... Okay. So, Mikael. Yes. Have any, you know, friends, rivals, <laughs> lovers yes. we should know about that are over in these caves? Really, sort of none of the above. <laughs> okay, okay, all right, all right. I don't think anyone is going to be friendly. Uh, I don't think I was enough of a threat to anyone to be a rival. Ah, I see. So they yeah. just, like, looked down on... I was just sort you. of there. You know, I was one of the, the pack, but I wasn't really... You know. Gotcha. Just, um, kind of... Existing. Yeah, I wasn't, you know, big or strong enough to be, like, actually a threat to, like, I the mean, order I mean, or anything. Well, well, I, mean, I think it'll be now. Yeah, uh, now, now you... you are. I mean, just... No, look at you. I mean, especially when you transform, like... I would not want to be on the opposite end when you're hitting things. I mean, you're That's nice right. to say. And now you're hitting things. It. You're doing so much better. <laughs> that is true. I have been hitting things more lately. I, I think you just had so that's some something, rust I guess. you had to work off, you know? Uh, uh, you know, I hadn't done anything like that in a long time. So, you know, I hadn't fought anything besides, like, deer and stuff in the woods, so... Well, deer don't really fight back. They don't really. That was, you know, it was an overstatement. I was just sort of... Yeah. I, but... I just thought of something. Mikael, if you return back there, will you be attacked on sight, or will you be, like, welcomed back? You know, I don't think welcomed. Ah, uh, well. Shoot. Uh-huh. You don't think you'll be welcomed? <laughs> um, no, I can't imagine they'll be happy. I mean, I, I sort of just ran away. Um, Did you just like... Uh, hold on, hold on. So, do you just, like, piss off everyone you're a part of? <laughs> I mean, there's them, then there's the Vistani camp. It, Wait, Sophie, just, Sophie, uh, she... She hasn't pissed off us yet. Not yet. Well, you have been actually I remarkably. I mean, you're cool right. with my whole deal. <laughs> Herogen's pissed me off more than anyone in this group. Oh, um, that's fair. So, yeah, it is. Okay, I would have thought so, that you would have kicked me out by now, but you know, I'm no, still here. Ah, so. oh, same, no. same. <laughs> you're you're fine. You're fine, Mikaya. Yeah. Okay. Um, any other, you know groups or villages you were a part of we should know about that also Truly, hate no. you? That's all of them. <laughs> Are you sure? <laughs> I was the Vasrani, I, I, and then I was with the wolves. I've always and then I was come... like a lonely hermit in Celestia. You know, okay. I didn't really talk to anyone over there. So I, I don't think they hate me. They might hate me. In threes. So... I don't know. At least some of them knew I was a werewolf and didn't really... Alright. Um, I don't know. The three is you guys. Whenever you guys decide. <laughs> ah, I You're see. tired of me. Right. That's gonna be um, the three, I think. Cool, mm -hmm. cool. Uh, yeah. Well, I'm looking well, forward you know, to I it. I think the third time's the charm. Uh, that's a more positive well, way of looking that, at it, that huh? That's a very uh, <laughs> positive way to look at it. Yeah, you know. Arrogant. It's optimistic. I... Hmm. Yeah, you know. It is. It's very... optimistic. Listen, you even turned down my uh, uh, request for uh, becoming 
werewolf. Um, yes. I'm not going to do that. And I would prefer everyone just to avoid mouths. Oliver. That's over there. All of them. <laughs> just, they might try to bite you, just kind of, you know, avoid that best, best we all can. Huh? How would a were plasmoid work? I don't know. And it frightens me to think about. <laughs> we do not need to know that information. And I don't I... know how the cat and the wolf would combine either, quite frankly. Again, or the rabbit and the... Range, I, I mean, prefer not to do that. I think rabbit... It would be very weird. I rabbit and the Rosa... Dampier and the... I think DeRosa would vibe with it more. DeRosa, um... I think, would be the best off of everyone. Tr truly. Well, but not, still. Not that, not that still I... not ideal, though. I still not ideal. We are avoiding it. Everyone, we are avoiding it. No, I don't think cats and dogs get along very well. I don't See, think she would thought. even work I, I out think very well. I think it is because well. I already have some, like, things what about that are the animal-like. You know, dog? like the tail and the ears and the things, the cause, you know, all those things. Dog? that is there Oh, that is a strange tale, the cat dog. <laughs> oh, please do tell while we're eating no. our breakfast. I will tell the story of the cat dog. <laughs> no. <laughs> the, it's probably while an abomination. <laughs> Yeah, it's, I'm sure there's all sorts of strange tales. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Of a horrid abomination. That's what I was thinking, Mira. <laughs> Look, there's... I do a great job. Are, are you are you nice. talking about the cartoon? Yes. Hold on. Yeah. 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 Yes. Yeah. That, that was what I was going to say. The fever mind. dream that was the cat dog cat cartoon. He's long oh and God. yellow. Yeah. And a head on either end. Yeah. Like, oh, Lord. I, I hope we don't run into him. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest. There's weirder things. Yes, but I'm mm. I'm sorry. Are you not telling me that some of the Avalith creatures that exist in worlds are not weirder than a cat dog? I mean, so... I'd rather run into that than an Avalith. I've never seen such a creature. <laughs> Neither have I. <laughs> I've only heard of them in stories. Well, let's hope none of us see anything quite so terrible or strange. Yeah. While we are here, huh? Yeah. Just don't go um, mining way too deep in a mountainside and open up a hidden cave and you'll be fine. Oh, did they delve too greedily and too deep? <laughs> uh huh. That is good to know. Good advice. Yeah. The, um, that's a weird question. I. I wonder if this place has an Underdark. Hmm. Interesting. Uh, Have I ever what? heard anything about <laughs> an Underdark situation? Just I'm just going to say the, uh, no. Above the ground, I can't I would imagine. That that there would be, <laughs> if there was one, there wouldn't be, be a reason for you to be... have heard anything about it. Cool. I've Did never heard of like... such a thing here, but God, something else. You were saying something? I d if if above the ground is bad enough as it is here, then I cannot imagine what an underdark would be at. Alternatively, probably pretty bad. It certainly wouldn't be good. Zila's hardly paying attention. She's just playing with her food at this point. <laughs> you don't seem all that hungry. Uh, are you okay, Zila? Do you want a good berry? Uh, I'm fine, thanks. Mm, bullshit. No, she's not fine. <laughs> <laughs> uh, bullshit. Uh, listen, we're all a party, and as far as I know, we've shared all of our deepest, darkest secrets, and... I mean, hell, a couple of us have died together. If there's anything you'd like to share with us, well... I have nothing that I want to share. And that's fine. Mm, that is fair. Mm -hmm. We can just live. But if you want us to kill anything, or take a nap, or whatever, then you let us know. <laughs> Lucky. Ah, oh, thank you. Thank you, DM. Ah. Imagery. Oh, 
Oh, we actually have Ooh. an in map. Yes. Yay! So it's no the longer table. theater of mind. Beautiful. Why does why does Irwin over there look like he's about to throw hands? Because that's just <laughs> that's the the, the, the default <laughs> version of these it's here. Irwin. <laughs> Top Irwin. Irwin yeah. is the husband. Oh. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, Irwin Danica. And Danica. Irwin and Danica, the husband and wife that own it. <laughs> and then two of the other. Yeah. They're they're two of the other uh, were ravens that you've seen. Uh, I, I'll give you I'll give you this, Joey. As she uh, says, I'm fine. I have nothing I want to talk about. She's mm. looking at the other patrons, and other people. I'll I'll lean over and whisper. Did did they give you a scare last night? I know it was kind of tense, but you know, it seems like we're all fine now. What? Mm. No, no, they did not scare me last night. Oh. Well, while we're telling the truth, I'll tell you, uh, they scared the shit out of me. I thought they were going to flay me. They were looking it looks to. Like they wanted to. Well, I wouldn't have let them flay you. I mean. Uh, same. Clearly. Yeah, I mean, they called me a demon and whatnot. I mean, you are not a demon, so let it be established. Ah, uh, well, yeah, no, I'm not. And he kind of puffs his chest out. He's yes, that is the, that is a good attitude to have. Good. All right. <clears throat> See you guys. Have your meal, some eating, some not. Um, and eh, work with me here, thing. Um, and begin to just discuss how your plans are going to go for the day. Uh, you guys know that you're going to be heading toward the wolves uh let me that's the wrong thing it, 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 it give me it, gib 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 imig no gib 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 um, please gib, gib sleep please <laughs> gib, please no sleep please sleep no sleep gib slip slip no sleep gib please <laughs> No exhaustion, plus inspiration, plus no. <laughs> advantage, plus <laughs> advantage, plus only ability tired. to roleplay, plus <laughs> words in my brain, plus <laughs> me every day. <laughs> I'm just gonna constantly have the disadvantage thing ready on the bottom left. Classic. <laughs> just always toggle on. Yeah, I wish I could just have an always on option. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately. Um, so <sighs> based on this map, <laughs> it, <sighs> map. Thank you. Um, so map. you guys are going to be heading. <laughs> actually, I need to give you the the party token. This the map. map. Oh. Ooh. Ah, so Inval them. Invalaki, this is true. There we go. Party <laughs> token! Yay! <laughs> Yay! Um, so which way are you guys planning to go? I mean, we're heading to the wolves, right? Yes? No? Maybe so? That yeah. was the plan, I thought. Mm -hmm. That's, That's what I thought, so. too. Okay, so you guys be are going to be heading, heading to the... Gotcha. Yep. We should Ooh, be heading holy west. water be done at the church? When did we order that? Uh, those oh, yes. It that could was... very well be possible. I should. We should check that while we're in town. Um, <laughs> Let's stop by that church first. Just because. We'll yeah. All right. You know, that's a, that's a quick gate, little hasn't it? skip and a jump. All right. Uh, DM. Yes. Sorry. I, I would know, presumably, at least, maybe if not exactly, approximately, how long it would take to get from Velaki to the. Okay. Let me 
my old place. Let's see. Your old stomping it took grounds. You, old I'm, it, correct me if I'm mistaken. No takers. Uh, if you wrote it down, I believe it took you guys four days to get to Kresk. One, two. Yeah, like that. it was about four days. Three. It was about no, four about days four. because one of the survival four, checks it was bad. Yeah. Yeah. Um. And to get cleared down, like, to Yester Hill and back up and stuff, that was over a week. It would be about the same amount of time it took you to get to Yester Hill. Okay. Um, it would be a little bit longer because there's not really paths. There's like, not, like, yeah. a... There's the... Road. Excuse me. There's not a there's road or a path that goes up there because the werewolves don't need them. Um, mm -hmm. So... Presumably, I would know, like, the wolf paths. Yeah, you would know, you would know the path out. that they took and that <laughs> you would have taken. But it's yeah. not as traversed, so it is going to be tougher. So it will take longer. Cool. I would say it'll probably Makes take, sense. I'd say probably about eight to nine days, depending on uh, All right. rolls. I will inform the others of this. It's going to take a week? Yeah, it's just it's about. Way away. Well, yeah, it yeah. is up north. It is through the woods. They're difficult to travel. Over the no roads. Through the woods. <laughs> oh. Well, well, we have time, and thanks I mean, to Harrigan, we'll be fine on food. Haha. <laughs> that is good. Alright. Well, you guys are... we stopping are... at the church first? Yeah, real quick. Yeah, yeah. Well, to just to see. While you guys are having this all, Zila... <laughs> okay. Yeah, oh, no. Let's go. <laughs> no, no. Oh, dear. Huh? Simply because you are as exhausted as you are, just with uh -huh, one. yep. But roleplay wise, I need you to roll me perception. It is not at disadvantage because of observant. This is to see if you can fight through your exhaustion to catch what I'm, what is happening. It will not be a disadvantage oh, though because of your feet. Ah, uh, well. Eleven. Not really. Unfortunately, you hmm. do not. I failed to However, perceive something, guys. <laughs> you did. You don't know that. You didn't Herogen. perceive it. Everybody, you don't know anything. Everybody else walked over the location. Because your passive perception is a 20. Right. Mm. Because wisdom caster. Um, Elliot. Harry. You begin to hear bells. And not like jingling bells. You begin to hear very large, loud bells ringing in the distance. And they begin um, to, you begin to hear more and more of them start to get closer. And you start to hear commotion outside of the tavern. Uh, guys, do you hear the bells? Or the panic outside? What? Uh, now that you mention it, um, yeah, maybe. Oh, uh, sorry, I was um, distracted on our <laughs> goal. Um, huh. We should Excuse go me. and check that out. Well, maybe just I want you to bring up the up. map for the end again. <laughs> yes. <laughs> map for the end. To see what what is going on? Yep, um, let's go see. The rest of you... Hold on. Oops. Thank you, Sophie. This this is, in fact, the Blue Water Inn. Thank you. Sorry, I drug it to the <laughs> spot incorrectly. Now it's working from my spot. Oh, I see. Okay. Yeah. I was wondering how you did that. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, I, I have my bottom bar almost full of location. Too bad the bottom bar sometimes breaks for me, so therefore I don't Same. trust. Same. Huh. I've never had a problem with it. That sucks. Well, I've also had to reinstall nice. my operating it system is nice. four times. Sounds like a skill issue. <laughs> <laughs> I've had to change computers. Engine issue. <laughs> uh. I roll to attack Chris. Do I hit with a 15? <laughs> Mm -hmm. Chris's AC. <laughs> what is Chris's yes. AC? <laughs> I roll to kill Nash. Oh, look. Oh, oh. <laughs> wow. Mm. 
That's a lot of damage. Uh, yeah. Jim's eyes as a result of being too close. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I avoided a trap <laughs> meant for me in the last session. Oh my god, I I am still <laughs> in shock that I was the one. Ah! In, in retrospect, I'm not. <sighs> Hindsight. Yeah. Anyway, okay. Funny. God. So Strong. things are happening. Yes. Back yes. Bells are ringing. Um, People are panicking. Yes. Possibly you begin dying. to hear, uh, all of you. Now that he's pointed this out, and you begin to hear it, and it starts getting louder. You begin to hear more commotion, um, outside of people running by the tavern. Um, and you'll see two people that will kind of burst in, startling everybody. Um. Oh, there's the entrance. Okay. And right as soon as they get into view, you see two vampire jump on the people and take oh, care of <laughs> uh, the oh. two question what yes we i would like we... to attack please well, <laughs> hold, on. Uh, hold on hold on i have a quick question because i'm slightly confused yes. on the scenario i thought we were coming back so we would be down here by the entrance not Coming already back inside. From where? Are we not eating breakfast? No, we slept at the you inn. You slept at the inn. I thought we started walking away and we heard bells. I am No, this was not... I know, we had not okay. You guys yeah, you guys yeah, started we like, yeah, we're going to leave. Yeah. I was like, wait. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> we <laughs> haven't so left yet. Okay. We were discussing reason, our plans. Yeah, yeah. I had we, thought we were, we were like, already going were like... this way and then <laughs> this happened. Yeah. Because yeah, we were maybe like getting up from Yeah, I threw you those things. Yeah, standing up from my chair. Just to be to more of just to keep you guys talking rather than dead air. Okay. As I was. You gave us. <laughs> I know. You gave us the town map and we mentioned the church, so I thought we were like actively like let's this walk away. Map, it wasn't because okay. he wanted to be nice to us. It was because he wanted to kill. Well, us no, actually, this, this yeah, map, exactly. this map has actually been done, and I keep forgetting to use it. Oh. Um. So this they is actually a, a map that I have for the inn, and I was like, hey, good time to use it. Okay, cool. So, and combat. I, w I would like uh, to attack. Roll initiative. <laughs> I would like to combat, please. Initiative. Yeah, I roll initiative at disadvantage. Woo! You sure do. Hey, that's still not a bad That's still not, not a bad. bad. Initiative. Yeah. But guess what? It's still better than mine. I thought you. <laughs> I, I thought that was a 19 for sure. Oh, it was cocked, and it decided to go with the lower number. Of course. Classic. Damn cocked dice. All right. <laughs> so, you guys suddenly having burst through these two vampires uh, just had are on top of these two people mouths around their neck. Uh, and the first one to go is Esmeralda. Ooh, exciting. 23, damn. Get up, yeah. Geralda. Uh, she is going to, what is, what is your spell list look like? I forget every time I do you. DM, can I request battle music? Yes. This Thank is very for chill. Reminding I'm so me. on grid. Can we get a grid, please? I mean, we were eating breakfast just now. Yeah. It's relaxed by the musical. Uh, grid. Yeah. Wow. Everybody's not on the grid. Get on the grid. <laughs> no. It's one of those where the grid doesn't quite line up the way I'd like it to because the map itself has a grid. Um, so it's Say a little me. off. Are those like two commoners just assumed dead? Uh, yeah. They have four hit points. Uh, yeah, they're gone. Mm. Commoners, yeah. In commoners are basically they just did. cannon fodder. Uh, I, also yeah. have a question. I yes. also have a question. So, 
astral construct you have it my int mod plus my scion level times my pro proficiency times two yes so times two so yeah because otherwise it has like five level hp six ten sixteen oh. okay i'm gonna adjust its hp because it's gone yeah it's been a while since you've used it so it hasn't been adjusted i cannot edit it uh, it's now it at be? 16 sir okay went up by four at the last level got it yeah all right uh don't forget um perigen and zila you should both have temp i, I have should six temp. yes but i've been splitting Man. it between two people now and you should both yeah, have six. i have six temp. i have six temp where is temp i have six temp okay just yep. making sure all right wow thanks zila so esmeralda zofie yeah. you mean i know <laughs> uh no. let's see what is oh that's too far you can't get up there lame um okay lame okay she is just gonna run to here. She's not gonna double move because she doesn't want to be the only target in front of them. Um, mm -hmm. But uh, she is going to. I guess she can magic missile. She will magic missile. All right. They really need to make this easier on me to figure out how to use. Uh, spells are not the easiest thing in the world to use on an NPC sheet in this program. Just is FYI. That is that DM side or player side? Uh, it would be uh, DM side, technically. It's just the, the way NPC sheets look are weird. Mm. Um, they don't really have, like, so, like, you guys, if you have a spell, you have, like, an attack you can pick. Um, these, you have to go into the block of text and find where the damage is and highlight it. Strange. And then no. bring it out, right-click to add the appropriate amount of die if it's, like, magic missile that's a three hit thing and then you can roll it it's not super intuitive for the dm um she's going to target that one and deal four damage better than nothing um but that is all that she's got right now oh i guess oh never mind that's how you're supposed to do it okay i see <laughs> um you learned i guess okay. yeah so apparently if i put the when i put the combat token on there it takes the npcs and throws their all their attacks and everything into a giant column that you can then select from good to know oh, yeah. handy nice yeah. All right. Uh, I want to check this real quick. Hold, please. Sorry. Radius. Okay. I don't know music now. I don't know if that's the thing. You yeah, just I'm gonna adjust it. It's there just, is music. Super... It's it's very quiet. There we go. That's better. Uh, ah. Yeah. It was just super quiet. Um. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Uh, I would like to cast Spike Growth centered on this point right here. It should... Oh, fuck. Never mind. Um, this point right here... Where my thing is? No, this one. Cause I, don't I don't see, see anything point. unless you let go. Oh. <laughs> this point. <laughs> okay. Because <laughs> otherwise, it'll reach all the way up to Sebastian, and I don't think I want to do that. Um, just 
Actually, I'm gonna take that back for a moment. Instead. Yeah, sorry, DM. I'm 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 taking that back. I'm I'm removing it. Just give me yeah. a second. Wait, there we go. All right. Um, instead. I want to try something different. I want to okay. go and use a uh, shillelagh as a bonus action. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. And I'm proud of you. I, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm proud of you. <laughs> I, I'm I'm being bold. I'm moving over to here. I believe in you. <laughs> and as my action, I'm going to wait for one of them to come close, and I'm a bonk. Okay, fair. All right. So you're gonna hold your action. All right. Next up is uh, Danica. She She's come back person. What's she doing? <laughs> she is. She is going to reach underneath the bar and pull out a crossbow. Heck Ooh, yeah! Bar. Damn, Danica. <laughs> they're they're tavern owners. It, rowdy people sometimes. In Barovia. Yeah. In Barovia. Look, well, look. They keep the shotgun under the. Floor. Also, yeah, exactly. let's be real. Yeah. 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 <laughs> this is the equivalent of a bartender holding a gun underneath their yeah. bar. I also, like, I am for this. Let's be real. Yeah. It is Barovia, and they're against Strahd, so... Yeah. It's logical, a point. in a way. Yeah. Uh, hmm, she's gonna miss, though. Oh. Yeah. Uh, but she has, mul she has multi-attack. Um, okay. So she is going to... Uh, Miss again. <laughs> re yep, we're just gonna reload the crossbow. Cause it's just a hand. Don't jinx her like that. Reload. She's gonna miss a second tie. You jinxed it. <laughs> it was one higher. Um, and then she is going to, uh, kind of take cover behind the bar, uh, which will then give her half cover. All right. First up is the first of the two vampire. Uh, vampire spawns. Um, let's see. What? Let's see. Who is it going to attack? Harrigan. Odds or evens? Harrigan. Harrigan. Joey, are you muted? Hello? Oh, All oh right. teacher, can I choose for him? Sh sure. I'm sorry. Were you talking to me? Yeah. Yes. I'm sorry. Harrigan. Who else is yes. Harrigan? I'm sorry. I wasn't paying attention. I got a text. Odds or evens? Evens. All right, it's gonna come up to you. Give me a bonk. Ah, uh, yeah. Because it will right. trigger your um, attack before target. it gets attack. I need to target. I need to. Oh, I need to see this real quick. How does this work? Okay, gotcha. Yeah. All right, you hey. hit. Hey, let's go. 12 damage. Nice. Oh, wow. Yeah. Nice. All right. Uh, all right. It is now going to take its turn and to attack you. Uh Okay. So it's going to attack you twice with claws. And it's going to crit. 
Oh, fuck. Oh, fun. <laughs> um, it doesn't. That's bad. I 12 I damage. Should it partially absorbed? Pardon? Yes, because of the six temp. Oh, yeah. yes, I see that. Yeah. Yeah. Um, anything else? Uh, it's going to do a second attack. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh, it's a claw. Okay. And miss. Hey. And that is all it's going to do. Drosta, you're up. Okay, great. Can I get over the bar stools, or do I have to go around the bar stools? Uh, I mean, you could feasibly knock them over. Like, they're just stools. Thematically, you could just knock them over <laughs> out of your way. I think in the face of vampire spawn, I don't think they'll be angry about you knocking over a bar stool. Just like, don't break them, bro. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm gonna hit this one twice with a sword. All right. Swing, bada bada. All right, you hit. Ooh. They don't have great ACs. That was one. And I think I get two attack. Yes, I do. Okay. Thank yeah, you, you do at this point. It's been a little while. So. Add another hit. And another Great. four damage. Nice. Uh, you hit this one. It... <laughs> you. I do it back. <laughs> Fair. Absolutely fair. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. That's All my right. turn. Zila. Mm -hmm. So, astral construct in this square. Okay. And I'm going to go ahead and solidify. All right. I'm going to give you its sheet. Yep. Thank you. There you go. It, it still says that it has 12 HP, but it's fine. Oh, well, it says it on the combat tracker. It says 16, so... Cool. It is officially um, I'm 16. also going to just adjust it. It wasn't quite on the square. Um, yep, it's solidified. And... Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm going to attack on a grow as well. Okay, so that's going to make it... A large, right? Uh, double, double, double the damage. Oh, but doesn't it in doesn't increase and, the size? And or? and increase by um, one size. Yeah, so it becomes a large creature. Yep. So, I now attack at advantage. Mm hmm On oh, hold on. Oh, it's a good thing that was given away. I'm gonna attack this one. There. Okay. Nice. And it's two of these, so I'll just do a one and a two. Nice. Good roll. Nice. Uh, nice. Very nice to uh, As you do that, uh, why did it not do... Damn. Oh, so you have to target... You, as yourself, will have to target the creature for the damage to go through. Because the damage is rolled off of your sheet, not off of the Astral Contract. Interesting. Just FYI. Um, okay, well... Um, because it's not... 23 damage? Yeah, because it's <laughs> not coming... Unless you drag the one off of the Astral Contract. But even then, I don't think it works that way. Uh, yeah, so with that... Um, with that one, you... Uh, what, the, what does the Astral Construct do to get rid of this vampire spawn? Oh, so whenever I do an Astral Construct, unless I say otherwise, it's going to look like a copy of Zila with a sword. And it just kind of slashes diagonal, diagonally through. Okay. So you kind of slash through this thing and it yes. just splayed open. 
uh, and collapses yep. on the ground. Yep. Cool. All right. But it's still there. Mikael. I'm not done with my turn yet. Oh, that's right. <laughs> sorry. Sorry. Excuse you. That was, sorry. That was the attack. That was just my actions. Um. Five, oh, that was 10, just your actions. 15, 20. <laughs> 25, 30. Will you allow me to do yeah, that? Yeah, that's fine. Um, bonus action. Projected weapons to my side. They're going to be They're just going to be little daggers right Is now it? because she's not okay. feeling she's not feeling good. Okay. Um and uh free action. If you guys can't fight, get out of the way. And now my turn is done. Okay. Mikael. All right. Can't really get to anything. You I can, can get to here if you'll allies. allow me to, yeah, you know, kind of do some leaps and bounds over the bar. Uh, so that's just like a basic, like, kind of table up against the wall. Um, sure. So I would say it, high it's. High off the ground? Sure. I mean, it's like table height. It's not like this that bad. Uh, give me a. Pr it's a pretty low check. Give me an athletics just to yeah. kind of hop up and up onto it. Yeah. Oh, easily. I, I jump over it so. Yeah. So easy. You hop up on there, no that was problem. That's graceful. Wow. Yeah. No problem can at all. Slide on it like a. <laughs> <laughs> but a mad lad. See, so here's the thing. Car. Car. Do you like yeah, exactly. Move to the exactly. Side as you <laughs> slide on it past her. <laughs> Thrust doesn't rest. Okay. That's. We can appreciate that. Um, shit. I don't really want to. Nah, fuck it. I'll double move. And just. Can I fit in that space? Uh, if I get on the other can't fit on that space because that okay. is a wall. Then I will be next to it. Alright, that's, that's fine. That's fine. Um. Yeah, I don't want to transform here. Fair. So I'm not going to do that. Uh, do I want to do that? Yeah. Okay. I'll uh, crimson raid on my uh, uh, my axe. So okay. I will take the damage if I can click the button. Is that necrotic damage? Yep, to myself. Er. Yep. Okay, whatever. Two, I take two damage. All right. End of turn. All right. It is going to be this vampire spawn's turn. Um, What's up? It is pinched, so it is not going to uh, move. But it also senses that the thing next to it is not made of flesh and blood, but the other one is. Oh, it's smart! Damn it! Hey, what's up? These they sense blood. Vampire spot. You want a piece of this? Uh, constructs not made of blood. Uh, I know, but man. Fair. It's what this is one of those creatures that instinct is more than their brain. Hey. Um, and it's going to miss. And it's going cool. to go in for a second attack. Cool. And I'm just going to wildly throw that off the table. Cool. Good. And it's going to miss again. Cool. Cool. Um, and it's going to cool, do cool, the same cool, kind cool. of. <laughs> for you. <laughs> Irina. Um, it would be so funny if she attempted the same move as Mikhail and messed up. Don't be mean to Irina. No. <laughs> that would be really like, funny. Let it be known. The rest of <laughs> to be so fair, it kind of over the table gracefully, super gracefully. That to would be, be fair, so funny. <laughs> she has a nine <laughs> intelligence. 
that's a but she fact. has yeah, a 14 up. wisdom. Jeez. She's not. She's okay, fairly wise. Okay, damn. Um, <laughs> Look, she's I, just a little lacking trying... in the intelligence. I think she could do it. Realistically speaking, she act. It would be hilarious. Realistically speaking, she honestly really probably could. Could she's um, strong? She's a she fighter. Is. Yeah, and she's a fighter, so she's actually got good strength. No, um, it's funny. I just feel like Arena needs a defender among the party. So. <laughs> yeah, so she. I, but I she's. Am, I am team Arena. <laughs> going to go here. Um, and then another five, and fifteen. Right, she's going to yeah, double yeah. move. Um. And kind of Get continue to help pincer this thing. Uh, in now, do you have anything you can do on your turn? Nope. Um. There's a set. Oh, she has an ability here. I need to know if she can use it. Nope, she can't use that. Dang it! Dang it, dang it, dang it. She can't use that one. I was hoping she could. Uh, but she has to attack to use it. Uh, oh, she can do this, though. Um... She is going to look over to Mikhail and she's like, I'm not very good at this, but please don't die. And she's going to do rally with her oh. superiority die. Oh. Uh, so uh, she is going to target you. Uh, now I have to see how this works because I've not used this ability. Superiority die of temp. I don't know if you add a base plus. Uh, her base is charisma plus. It uh. does. So you get eight temp hit points. Look at me. Oh. Hey, yo. Uh, hey, Irina. And she expends one of her superiority die. I had to look at how that worked. I was like, I've never used a superiority <laughs> die. How did these work? It's new. <laughs> because of Becky, I am very familiar with <laughs> superiority die and Battlemaster stuff. I appreciate that because I'm not, so I'm <laughs> learning it as I go with her. Uh, uh, I know all the common ones. <laughs> uh, so that's all she can do. That's her move bonus and her uh, action. Now we go to Sebastian. Um, and he's gonna look to you and say, "We didn't live this long without being able to fight." And he's going to come run down here. He says he runs forward and dies. <laughs> <laughs> Probably. <laughs> it's, it's gonna happen. Just, I was I'm just like, "Sebastian, now!" <laughs> like in my head. He did not know these would he be his the final one. words. Oh my god, dude. He did it's not what, know these would be happen. his final god. words. No. Uh, and he's going to leave himself open <laughs> for an attack, a singular attack from the vampire spawn. <laughs> uh, <laughs> in all fairness, it could miss. Oh, it what hit just barely. Subtract two from it. Uh, it will miss then. I blood curse of the eyeless, so the vampire goes blind for a second. Oh, okay. So is it just Unless for that? Unless it's immune to the blinded condition. <laughs> it is not. It's just for that attack roll. Okay, and it only gets for the singular, a singular one. So. For uh, anyone who is curious, Zila is not amused. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, they don't fight vampire spawns all the time. That time he's going to hit. See? Uh, and do five damage. 
Alright. That's his turn. Where are you guys aren't that great, guys? Uh, <laughs> Sophie. Uh, I you try. finally get to go. <laughs> There's a lot. There's a lot of NPCs, you're man. Going to roll There's a lot going yeah, I on. I wonder what you're going to do. All right. Well, you're not Eldritch uh, Blast. How <laughs> did vampires get this far into the city? No, uh, you want to target two, not one. Uh, I forgot to roll an advantage to so hold on. And uh, no, I wanted to target number one. Oh, the one that's dead. Okay. Oh, it's dead. Yeah, yes. everyone's dead. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I. All right. You were not paying attention. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. My turn I was like way it. fucking down. That's so, you know, it's I, I slashed it in so, half, sir. <laughs> I mean, yeah. After I gave it a good bonk. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> okay. Ouch. Alrighty. That's awesome. my turn. That's your turn. All right, Johan. There's not really a place that he can get to it. Um. So he's going to go here, and is going to attempt to shoot at it with a crossbow. He pulls out a little hand crossbow. He's going to hit with a 17. Hmm. And do max damage. Hey -oh. And he's going to reload, take a second attack. That, that why, was, was that short, sword? short sword, yes. Oh, why did that? It's the same damage, so that's okay. Same okay. damage, same attack. So, uh, he's going to miss the second one. Um,. Thankfully, there's nobody behind the uh, vampire spawn as the shot goes <laughs> right next to Irina's head into the wall behind her. That sucked. <laughs> um, sorry. Uh, and she's just going to glare at him. Um, Erwin. He. Let's see. What is your... I just realized I was muted for God knows how long. Is Johan uh, one of the kids, or is he like just a random patron? Uh, he's one of the were ravens. He's not the kids. Oh, he's just one of the, the additional were ravens. Like the older ravens. Oh, uh, this God. is part of the younger. These are the two guys that you see helping around the tavern. These are the other two guys that you see a lot around the tavern. When Erwin okay, and like Danica are not running it, these the two are running it. Yeah, got it. Um, so they're younger. They're probably in their 30s. Um, they're not the super old guys. Um, they're about the same age as uh, Danica and Erwin. Uh, so he is going to run down here. Um, and come... He can't stand there. Because things... So he's going to go there. Um... That's unfortunately all he can do because he has to use his bonus action or his action and movement to get there. So he's just going to double move. Um, that's all he can do. Hey, Vasilka. Vasilka. <laughs> hey. 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 at the bottom. Uh, well, that one odd initiative. <laughs> I wasn't last. <laughs> to be you fair, she rolled last. a two. Uh, I see. <laughs> she doesn't oh, have a she doesn't have she doesn't have oh, a dexterity to save her life. She doesn't have dexterity, I know, but still uh, poor Basilka. <laughs> yeah. I know. Um I mean she's There's really nothing she can do. Uh so she's just gonna come up here by you. Because there's really, like, she, she doesn't have any options to do things, so she's just going to come stand up by the group. Just coming to hang out. I, cool. She doesn't have any ranged weaponry, so. Uh, you could take her arm off and throw it. <laughs> she could double move. 
Yeah, but she can't get within a range that she can hit. That's the problem. Well, just to double move to get into position? I don't know. I guess it doesn't matter. Yeah, there's really nothing much for her to be able to do, unfortunately. Um, those don't go. Esmeralda. Um, she is going to go. All right. One is dead. But that does not mean it's going to stay that way. You have to finish them first. And she's going to run up here. And reach into her pack and grab a stake and jab it through its heart. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Which will then be dead. Uh... Oh god, they have purple blood. Do I have purple blood? <laughs> I don't know. Do you want to try? <laughs> uh, maybe As she just kind of winks at you with a little tell. smile. Uh, maybe later. There <laughs> seems to be more of them. <laughs> Um, so that is going to be, let's see, that was only about 10 feet of movement. So she's going to come here and she's just going to firebolt it because she doesn't want to use a bunch of spells on this. Um, she's going to firebolt and hit. And do not quite minimum damage, but almost. Mm. Uh, two damage. Um, but that's all she's got. So, uh, Herogen, you're up. All right. Uh, Sebastian over here. I'm clicking as if this is roll 20. Sebastian, he got hit, didn't he? Uh, mm. no, it missed. No? Who, because what, of Mikael, uh, doing the interference. Oh, right. yep. It oh, missed. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um. <laughs> well then. Um. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Um. Oh, hell. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do... So I'm going to move here. Oop. Wait. Okay. There. And then I want to step... J I'm, I'm double moving. I want to step just outside the door, and I want to take a look around the outside of the building. What, what's going on around the town? Um, so what you see... Uh, go ahead and roll a perception check to get some finer details. I'll give you an overview, but roll perception to see gotcha, just what you gotcha. see. Gotcha. Perception? Yes. 18 jeez uh yeah, okay <laughs> okay eight for an 18 that's like ayaki's rules um what you see is the town seems to be in a panic people are running everywhere uh you hear the bells going and you see guards running um through the town heading toward one of the gates um and uh, you see <clears throat> other, uh, some guards are running toward gates. Some guards are running the other way. Some are running through the town. Um, and you hear noises of various battle happening all around the city. Do any guards run nearby? Yeah. So if you... It's hard to like, tell like, because there's a well right here, but that is actually supposed to be a road. Um, that was part of the, uh, uh, like this whole section that runs right in front between it and the other building is supposed to be a road. It's just hard to tell I with the you. fog. Yeah. Um, so okay. yeah, so you would have guards that come run down that street. Um, um could I yell at one of the guards? Oi, what the hell is going on? <laughs> Stay inside. We're being attacked. 
and then he just keeps going. Uh, what? It, uh, God damn it. All right. Uh, they don't know who I'll, you are. <laughs> You're far yeah, through but... You're just a random civilian. And that's fair. I'll run back in the tavern and say, the whole town's under attack. It looks like the guards are running towards the gate. Well, okay. Let me clarify. Oh, this toward the gate, both gates, and into the town. Just all over. Yeah. Oh, both gates are being attacked? Yeah. One, so, okay. One gate, there is a large group of guards running toward. Mm. But there are guards running toward, there is a smaller group running toward the other the other gate, as well as a, a group running in toward, like, the town square, toward the rest of the city. Uh, but there's a larger I'll, force running toward one gate. I'll relay that to the rest of the yeah, party. Yeah, I, I did not make that very clear when I was describing it. And... Actions. Do I have any spells? Well, no, I've already used my actions to double move. I'm done. Alright. Danica is not in a great position, so she's going to hold her action for if the giant thing in the way moves. Because um, cool. she doesn't want to accidentally hit it. And she doesn't have a great line of sight on the thing behind it. Thrusta. Um, can I get around to, like the right side of that vampire spawn, or is that not allowed because there's a wall there? Um... So you could get around to like here, if you want to get yeah. in, like if you want to get to like here, is that what you're trying to do? Yeah, I want to get it all up in there. Um, unfortunately, no, because it's kind of like a countertop there. It goes uh, into the kitchen. Um, okay. It's like where the dishes get brought up, type of thing. <laughs> See. It didn't get a chance to move, so it got trapped in a corner. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, stay right there. It, it hasn't have a choice. <laughs> it can't go anywhere. It's right. trapped. Well, I cannot get into it. I'm going to shoot it with my little crossbow. Okay. Or I'll try to. My little light crossbow. Not with that three. Nope. Is that allowed to attack twice? Is that a thing I can do with the crossbow? Um, I think to use anything more than a hand crossbow twice, I think requires you to reload. I think I hand. Correct me what, if I'm wrong, DMs. What is the re? Um, it's a That's natural a, loading. Low uh, loading uh, crossbow still yeah. needs to reload. Yeah, you still have to reload a hand crossbow what unless you have how, the how do I, how do cross... I... Yeah, there's a crossbow master or whatever. Yeah. Bonus so the... action unless it's a heavy crossbow. Okay. La, hand and light are bonus. Yeah, heavy right, is an right. action. Yeah. Unless you right. have crossbow expert. I do that. Yep. And then crossbow no, expert again. negates the reload for the other two. You just is ignore that... loading <laughs> property overall. Yeah. Okay. Ah, that's right. That's right. Does heavy crossbow reloading go down to a no. bonus? Ignore no, that second uh, one. That was the it wrong just goes to It's gone. Yeah, you oh, just don't. ignore it. That did not count. Oh. Okay. Um, undo the crit because I did not. <laughs> I did not. Hit uh, okay. Um, the second one was a seventeen, and that hit. <laughs> okay, so what we're so just roll to try to hit it again, and we'll just okay. Otherwise, it'll try and do the. I pressed the twenty, not the okay, other we'll one. Okay, we'll try that again. Oh. Oops. <laughs> nope. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh. I cast a bliss. <laughs> I believe in you. Hit it. Hey, okay, that one hit. <laughs> See, third oh, okay. time's the charm. Nice hit. All right. All right. That's what I do. <laughs> All right. Zila. Okay, bonus action, bonk, with <laughs> with the actual <laughs> construct, but bonk. it is now down a size. So hold on. A I was just gonna say, I, doesn't it shrink? Yeah, on the next turn. Yeah, you... I'm gonna make okay, it shrink so. that way. That's fine. Ready to action goes off. Uh, yes, correct. Because 
Yes, she did say she was holding in case the shot opened up. So I'll wait. Uh, yep, I'm getting your stuff. 19. Very nice. Oh. Ew. <laughs> she rolled one damage. <laughs> For three. Um... Okay. Uh, I don't think they, you can't multi-attack on a held action, though, can you? No. I didn't think so. No. So that's all she's got. All right, bonus action, bonk. <laughs> uh, oh no, no, no! I'm pretty sure it's whenever you take the attack action. So I think a ready to action, you are still taking the attack action, and you get extra attack on it. Uh, okay. uh, Go ahead. The way, extra, the way extra attack reads is when you take the attack action, you can make a second you get to attack. Do it again. Yeah, but yeah. they so, took they took a readied action, right? Right, which is still yeah, in the, attack, the attack, action. attack action. Oh. I mean, feel free to rule differently, DM. I'm just I'm just double checking. If it was a reaction from someone moving out of your range, that's one hit. But if it's a readied action, I believe you get both your attacks. Uh, for the rules of the game, multi-attack cannot be used with a ready action. Oh. Huh. Multi-attack. That's not extra attack. Oh, oh, oh. Uh -huh. They have multi-attack. It's Creature versus PC. Um, good, good, good. Yeah. Can I bonk? Yes, you may bonk. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, we had I, to clear that up because that was going to set the precedence for other okay, things that have it. So that's my bonus. Okay. Uh, main hand is telekinetic weapon. Ranged bonk, go. That's a nat, nat 20, 20, baby. Nice. <laughs> All right, so that yeah. was my, hold on, hold, please hold. So it's this one. And boop. Eight. Nice. And because this is the second turn with it, unless it's dead. Uh, or fallen. Let's see. I'll just throw it on anyways. Do. Okay, so that's gonna do. So... Nope, that all. It is still up. Dang it. Cool. Um, um... But it definitely, out of anything, that seems to go. Definitely through. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Nah, 25. I'll go there. And. Jad is my turn, sir. All right. Mikael. All right, bitch. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> let's go. Did that not? It hit. No, I. Oh, I didn't see it for a second. Oh, yeah, okay. it hit. Anyway. God damn. All right. Yes. Nice. Yep, you do enough to take it down. Cool. For my second attack, would you allow me to switch weapons? Uh, you would. Yeah, it would be a your. It'd be free object, action, intera yeah, free object action. interaction. Yeah. Bullshit. Yep. Whatever. Cool. I take out a. Uh, I have stakes. I take out a mm -hmm. stake and I. Stab into its heart. <laughs> All right, and with that, the vampire. Um, once it when it hits, you see the thing kind of uh, just <laughs> dissolve into a kind of a dust. Um, once you stab it, it just kind of <laughs> dissipates. Cool. Um, all right. You are out of combat initiative currently so feel free to so 
Where the hell are we going? Uh, sorry, I'm <laughs> are just we going to go help out the guards or are we just going up. to like leave? Uh, oh, hey, Ravens, uh, what would you like us to do? I say we help. I agree. I, I think it would should. be best to help. Probably help everyone. It was agreed to helping, yes. Yes. Eh, I'm down for that. All right. So you guys... I would, I would like to take a peek outside. Is there any immediate vampire spawns? Not immediately outside, no. Cool. Um, okay. For hopefully simplicity's sake, I'm going to clump you well, all together. Okay, how about, how about this? How soon do we feel we're going to be seeing something, DM? If it's in, if it's outside of a minute, go ahead and get rid of the astral construct. Uh, yeah, it would probably be. It would probably, yeah, yeah it would probably take more than just a minute. My uh, shillelagh drops. Oh, Actually, man. it's a it's a can trip. I'll keep casting oh, it. I get my <laughs> crossbow bolts from the vampire spawns dead body. Uh, I'll just okay. constantly be making. I'll just constantly be doing my projected weaponry. It's like a cantrip to Harrigan. This is, you know, yeah. you know the deal. All right. So. We are going to be changing the map real quick. I've only got five bolts or else I would care less, but I only have five. <laughs> so, you know. What? <laughs> oh, wait, are they uh, crossbow bolts? I think bolts? I have some bolts. Yeah, they're, they're, they're the light crossbow bolts. Uh... I've only got four, otherwise I'd share. I apparently have 30. <laughs> the hell? Really Why do you have so many? Bucks? I don't know. <laughs> well, to be wait, fair, wait, wait, wait. I think that he looted them off of multi well, all the Vastani bandits that you've encountered first. Oh, that might be yeah. possible. Yeah. And also, I think yeah, that fair. you have all the bolts from Holbart. Oh, that I might be. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. No, these are anyway, just like, well, she wants I some. Off that body, like a light crossbow, and I was like, ooh, fancy. Yeah, I don't like, use this thing very cool. much. If this I could is, take like, some, I'd like that. As for sure. running. I prefer the swords, but like the crossbow is nice in, in cases where I cannot get close enough right yeah, away. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm like digging around in my backpack as we're running. I give you each ten. <laughs> awesome. Okay. I have bolts too. Okay, well, <laughs> why, why, why don't you? Why didn't you say so? Psionic bolts. Oh well, I'm <laughs> not good enough for my unless you want to load. You know, unless you'll you have bolts in your head. Mikael, you'll offer Zila and she'll decline. I I can make some myself if necessary. Okay, I didn't have enough to give ten to everybody. <laughs> I was just giving them to Herogen and Dorosta because oh, they asked. What I, I thought. I'm sorry. You said everyone. <laughs> no, I only have thirty. I'm keeping ten to myself. Okay, okay, I'm okay. I'm giving ten to those two. I, I retract my statement. If you want yeah. to keep more, I could just take five and then have ten total, and then you. Can no, 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 no. Okay, <laughs> this is okay. good. If you say so. Let's go. All right. Well, I'll take the ten. No questions asked. <laughs> oh, uh, if being if that being not said, that I don't I, think you need them. Just I assume you have other means. <laughs> I've already given the swords from you. Like I do not need all of your bolt too. I am shattering. Let me. All right. Do that. So here is the next map. Uh oh. What streets? Unidentified. <gasps> Well, it's mainly because I had the number of them, and I don't want you to know how many numbers there are. Yeah. Terrifying. Uh, because uh, it was the only way it's I could fine. keep straight how I wanted this to work. <laughs> was if I numbered them. That makes uh, sense. Makes sense. Okay. All right. So as you guys uh come like out to of the action. yep, so you guys uh come out of the um. Tavern, thank my brain today. Um, and for that, yes, it did. Um, you guys, uh, begin to see, uh, various, 
uh, other creatures uh, wandering the streets chasing uh, a few of the people around the town. Um, I will kind of throw things on the map here. Just give me a second. Um, uh, so you come out, you see, you hear people running, um, and you see some of the guards kind of ushering people, um, in the direction toward the west, uh, end of the town. Um, which, Herjan, that's also where you saw the bulk of the guards heading. Um, and when you come out, uh, you're going to see some of these uh, creatures uh, lumbering around. And you are going to see... Bum, 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 bum. Some uh, undead... Oh. Uh, um, creatures. Um, why game? Can I get? No, give me. <sighs> okay, fine, fine, fine. It's fine. It's fine. One zombie is straddling a grid. Two of them are Zombie Three and Strahd ah. Zombie One. Yeah. yeah. Ignore the fact they're called Strahd Zombie. It's just how it's delineated in the thing. It does not mean that it comes from Strahd. Doubt. <laughs> they're from Strahd. No, <laughs> it's just. I smell it. <laughs> it is simply how it is denoted in the uh, DM thing. I'm sure that the source of all evil in this land has nothing to do with this. <laughs> you don't know. Oh, it's not the source of all evil, is he? <laughs> like 90% of the evil, probably. At least a good portion of the evil. Um, Damn near all. Got it. And you will also see, though... Uh... Oh. In amongst these things, uh, there are a few kind of town guard. Months. Uh, show yourself. Um, who are attempting uh, to kind of hold these creatures off um, as they are lumbering toward uh you guys at the tavern so we jump back up to the top of initiative esmeralda she is going to move her 30 uh, excuse me game okay. she's going to move for 30 feet And is going to attack uh, the first zombie here. Try to help this guard out. And she's just going to firebolt. She's going to hit. Uh, and do max damage. Hell yeah. Nice. Let's go, Esmeralda. So, here's the. I kind of want this to be slightly more cinematic than just singular, like six zombies. <laughs> so, in your heads, picture that these are more like uh, a swarm almost. So, as you do damage, okay. you are actually killing multiple of them. Hmm. Okay. Um, so. You know, have some fun with it when you describe how things happen and how things get killed. Um, I'll try to do my best as well. But 
um, there will be a few things like the straw zombies are just beefier zombies. Those are singular zombie. The rest, the other four are more like a swarm. Um, so have some fun describing things. So she's going to shoot the uh, firebolt and it's going to go right over the guard's head who is unaware that you guys are behind them. Um, <laughs> and it's just going to kind of hit just a swath straight through uh, this group of zombies. Um, as the guard is kind of trying to beat them back and hold them off um, and keep himself alive. Uh, he's going to get startled for a second. Thank you. Okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, unsure and unaware of what is happening. Harrigan, you're up. Here, you're talking, you're muted. Joey. Thanks, Joey. appreciate it. Fuck my life. <laughs> <laughs> Always. Yeah. Like sound alert. That's just this Joey muted. <laughs> <laughs> I can do that. Yeah. We can do that. We can upload can custom ones. <laughs> oh, God. Um, <laughs> I'm going to move over to here. Right behind. Uh, I can't move DM. Oh, sorry. I forgot to unlock token. We don't there you have go. Permission. All good. All right. I move here. Uh, what kind of line of sight do I have? I don't know that these three exist, but I know this one, this one, this one exists. Unless it, are are these like walls here? Can I see? Uh, they're this? like half walls, so you can see over them. They're not like full height. Ah. Uh, they're almost okay, more like so a. They serve like, more as a railing okay. to divide the uh, walkway. Okay, so I can clearly see all of the zombies yes. from here. Well, you can see the yeah, you can see the the kind of mass of them that's moving up there. All right. Well, it, in my mind, if there's an actual mass of them, then I'm definitely casting spike growth. Let's say right about here. Oh, whoops. Nope, that's gonna hit them. Yeah. Basically, the way I'm okay. kind of using centered it on mine, this point is that. Every two damage you do is a zombie. Gotcha. Do you see the 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 point I yes. highlighted? So how big is that again? Uh, twenty foot radius. I will send in chat. So okay. Mm, yes. Nice. So all the way out to this point, and all the way out to this point. <laughs> so that. Yes. Okay. Nice. That is now difficult terrain. And if they move, they take damage. Got it. 2d4 every five feet. Okay. Yeah. Nope. That's good. All right. Anything else? Uh, I want to ask one of the guards. Oi, where the hell are these things coming from? I don't know. They just suddenly... They were just suddenly here. I don't know where they came from. They were suddenly here. Oh, okay, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Not every guard is going to have all the information you want. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> and plus, you know that they were ringing the bell to call people, so they may not have all necessarily been on duty at the time they were called. <laughs> One of them running around in basically underwear in a tank top. <laughs> you never know, you might encounter one. I mean I've I've seen documentaries that, that, that happens in actual combat. If you attack a base, they're they're gonna be swarming whether they have their equipment or not. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Alright. Uh so zombie. Number three, what, you don't target yourself, you idiot. <laughs> you need target, target that one. Uh, it's going to miss with its first attack. Uh, and miss with the second. So as the, they kind of try to come up and swipe at it, he just kind of keeps batting them away with... They have not the full-size pikes like the guys at the gates had, but... You see, these guys definitely have spears, like so they've got some reach to them. So they're kind of 
waving out and pushing them back, trying to keep them at bay. Um, so as the zombies try to come closer, they just kind of keep swinging back and forth, kind of knocking their hands away and kind of shoving them back as they get close. All right. Danica. Um, she can move to here and is going to uh, aim at the group that Esmeralda did um, and shoot the crossbow. Gonna hit. And it went off the table, so I don't even get the damage. Roll again. All right, so as she shoots, um, there's enough. Some of the zombies are, like, they've got some holes in them, and you can see that some of them have already been in a fight of some kind. So as she shoots, her bolt actually goes through about three of them. Um, just, like, through holes in them tearing out the back side of them uh, and uh, taking out a, f a few more of them that uh, that that horde uh, if you want to call it that um, is looking like pretty getting pretty thinned out nice um, that is all that she can do so now that horde has got the thing in front of it it's going to attack it. It's going to miss. Um, and it's going to try it again. And it's going to miss again. Nice. They're not super strong. Uh, so this guard, um, he is going to... So he's kind of trying to help hold the line here. He's going to attack the weaker of the group um, where there's a less amount of them to try to help get rid of some um, he's going to hit um, he is using this two handed so he gets the higher damage um, and you see as he kind of uh, swings uh, through Kind of in a sweeping motion, he cuts down, like cuts them off at their legs, and then takes and stabs through and finishes off the last of that zombie group. Um, but they only get one attack. <laughs> so, Thrusta, you're up. All right. I'm getting closer. <laughs> I believe you do. I think I'll do me a little scorching right. That sounds fun. Alrighty. Woohoo. I get what? Three? Yeah, three. Three, at so least. Yep. I'll do. One on each of the big, beefier ones, and then one under that swarm of zombos that are closer, so. Okay. <clears throat> uh, let's see. I think I have to target, like, one at a time. That would probably be the easiest way to do that. Uh, no, I think if you target all three of them and you roll, it should tell you whether okay. it'll attack all three. I guess you, if you, I, well, target them individually because you'll get different rolls. Because it's not all the same attack roll. It's different rolls yeah. per thing, so I'll yeah. do one on this one. I, that's kind of tedious, but unfortunately. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Or if you would prefer, you can just roll three, and I can tell you if they hit. Well, that's a one. The <laughs> oh. DM. I... Oh wait, 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 wait. Well. Um, never mind. Yeah. Never mind. Roll, roll a d twenty luck. Oh. Ah. <laughs> Oh my god! Uh, uh, <laughs> well, all right. I uh, I'm gonna need you to target guard number two with that no. first attack. Uh, 
I'm oh, sorry. Oh no! Not poor guard. Not the double two. that ones. <laughs> oh. oh. You're gonna hit him, and you hit him just square in the back. Um, yeah. he kind of stumbles for a second. Uh, <sighs> I am so sorry. My apologies. I am <laughs> sorry. Um. Um. He's. You can tell that he's angry, but he's a little bit, unfortunately, d distracted, and he can't do anything about it. <laughs> That's better. All right. Hey. Ooh, nice. And max damage. Let's go. Let's see, that was two, one. Ah. Ooh. <laughs> Minimal damage. <laughs> Incredible. We're all over the board tonight. Okay. Hey, you got rid uh, of one of them. Down. You got rid of one of them. Don't worry about it. No, I didn't. Oh, that's true. That's true. No, two no, damage is, that, is each one. Two damage is one zombie. Oh, yes. I got. Well, uh, no, not with the, the, the two straws. So <laughs> the two straws yeah, are large the zombies. Boys. Yeah, I targeted the big boys. Uh, yeah. that's right. They're the exception. Uh, see, base I zombies are zombies, multiple. zombies, I promise. Um. The base zombies are multiple. The two strands are individual. Uh, gotcha. A little two spell slot. Okay. All right. Uh, I think that's good. All right. Zila. Where did I have all that stuff? I'm 60 feet. Please hold. Zoom out. Can I see them from here? Or is there stuff in the way? Is there stuff in the way here? Is there like buildings and stuff? Uh, or like no, what, so that's, what's this right here? Uh, so that that's the same thing that Joey was talking about earlier. That's like a half wall kind of railing. Okay, cool, 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 cool. All right, F uh, five, and I can move through people. Yes, you can move through allies. 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. Okay, and yeah, they're definitely in my range now. Um. I am going to hit these two like that with a uh, zone of telekinetic force, please. I need strength a saves. Link, please. Thank you. Okay, they have to succeed a strength saving throw. Oh, lovely. Yep. Um. <laughs> Look, I want to go bowling. That's what's going on here. <laughs> what is the DC? Um, this DC is 15. Uh, zombie one saves. Damn. Or zombies one save. As zombies too does not. Yay! Okay. Boom. It's saber sucks, so they take six damage plus. Please hold. Um, where is the thingy? It's right here. It's been long enough, so it's reset down to a D4. So they take eight damage, so that would be four zombies. So I yep. go bowling and I knock over four zombies. They just go poof. <laughs> All right, yeah. In the air. So yeah, you and the throw up these. Kind of... How how crazy yeah. are the physics of them flying in the air? Do you describe? I do have to say it is, it is a telekinetic force attack. They do get pushed, shoved five feet in a direction of my choosing. So the ones that failed, I would like, because we already discussed this. Since the center is uh right here, DM, mm -hmm. I want the uh I want them to go that way. Okay. And Joey, roll damage. <laughs> I uh, roll damage. Yep. Whoa. Yeah. Yep, they get forced movement. Someone was asking about the physics. This is this is what they had in mind. Anyway. Uh, um, yeah, this is the physics. So uh, I was absolutely going to say like, it's G-Mod physics. Like, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. four All right. of them just go flying up in the air, like clearly limp at this point. Like there's parts of it that are just like disappearing. The other ones get forced through the um, spike growth. Gotcha. Uh, which ones am I targeting? 
Uh, zombie zombie two. 2. I forgot target to target mode, them. My sorry. That sorry, last you. I did that a number of times as an officer in GTA RP. Because <laughs> I was really bad about forgetting my seatbelt in a police car. Great. Uh, great. Great. Another three of them just like in the spike growth just stop moving. <laughs> they get shredded. Yeah. All right. Nice. Um, yeah, so there's um, a... Yeah. You, you do a good chunk of damage to them. Uh, so all of them get kind of thrown and land. Um, a few of them end up kind of hitting this wall of this building back here um, and splatter across it. Um, and you see a few of them kind of lumber back up to their feet. Uh, but much less than there was just a second ago. Um, you also now have one that's crawling. Um, <laughs> oh no! It's a Mel! It's a Mel! Sorry, it's that's a I, Mel. <laughs> we need Quick context. Story. Quick story: Seven Days to Die. There's crawling zombies in it. I always mm. call them Mel. I I always call them Mel. They look like a Mel to me. I don't know. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Is that so, Mel short for Melissa? No, Mel short for like Melvin. Ah, <laughs> uh, I gotcha. Okay. So I, I don't know why it's just Mel. Anyways, okay, cool. So that's my action. I've used my movement. Um, I don't really have anything for my bonus. I already have been creating daggers at my side. So that's my turn. All right. Mikael. I run. Mm-hmm. All right. Can we run? Oh, yes. <laughs> then <All right>. I wait. <laughs> yeah, that's <laughs> unfortunately kind of all you got right now. Yep. Irina. is also just going to run. <laughs> that's all she got. She don't got any range. Running, 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 running. Uh, guard number one. He's gonna come down here. Um, and he could gonna... flank. Over here. He could, actually. He would, he would probably do that. They're intelligent. Um, so he's gonna give himself advantage. Look at him. Maybe he can hit. Wow. Maybe. Yep. Hey, he he needed that advantage. Um, and roll max damage though. Hell hey, yeah. oh. Um, let's see. Uh, so <clears throat> as he kind of runs up and just kind of runs the spear through, he ends up stabbing through about. He ends up stabbing through three of them. Um, and then as he like pulls it out um one kind of comes up toward him and he kind of swings to block and ends up uh taking out that one as well nice um, as he tries to kind of block its attack he ends up uh just kind of reactively going like this to block it and ends up just slicing across it um <laughs> and taking that one out as well look at guard number one go guard Hell number yeah. three he, now he has is advantage. number one. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> no, he's number three, actually. Well, he is. I'm talking and about he's... number one out here. Why at <laughs> Zofie? Why are you talking? What? Why are you talking? Well, a seven's going to oh miss anyways, I think. <laughs> a seven, yes, misses. But I don't know why he was targeting you. That doesn't... He's not targeting anybody. Well, That's weird. Well, unfortunate. He misses. Uh... Zombies aren't smart. Uh, Yay. That's what we're hoping for. Let me look Five, at it. I'm just going to post this 10, real quick. 15, 20, yeah. 25. Okay, okay, I need... 10d4. Yep. <laughs> They're not intelligent creatures. <laughs> so I need yeah, 10d4 okay. damage against this zombie horde. Gotcha. Five. No, that's six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
Um, actually, let me let me target him real quick. Zombie one. Zombie one. Yep, the one right next to guard one. Gotcha. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Glorious. Ooh. Next. Uh, th yeah. as they <laughs> walk through, and they kind of lumber through, you just start seeing them drop. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> uh, and nice, Hedogen. Good job. The final oh, one you. of the group. Thunk, right at his feet. <laughs> nice. Doing Perfect. 26 damage and wiping out that horde. Spike growth is amazing. It is. Uh, it Sebastian. is such a good spell. Uh, you have 30 feet. Although... No, he's not going to do that right now. Uh, for roughly basically the same reason Mikael's not. Uh, <laughs> he is going to, since he has a short sword, or is, is not a short sword, his uh, crossbow, he is going to aim at this zombie horde. And he's going to hit. Nice. And nice. he's going to let's see how many. What is that one's health? Okay. Um, he is actually going to take out with his um mechanically one bolt. Thematically, he's going to fire a couple. Um, and he's going to end up taking out four other zombies. He just kind of uh basically like fires and just kind of reloads it as soon as, as fast as he can to kind of shoot it. Um, and uh, you see just right between the eyes on four different zombies um, just doo -doo -doo, takes them uh, and takes them out. Takes down a good number of them. That, uh, that horde is looking pretty small by this point. Um, there's only... there's. Only a handful of them left. Zofi. Yes. I'm just double checking something. Okay. Sure. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. So mechanically it counts as one creature correct yes mechanically it is a single entity thematically cool. it is multiple give me a strength save okay um what is the dc uh my dc i guarantee you i lost it should be the same as mine is 15. i guarantee yeah, you 15. i lost yeah cool <laughs> great so I'm going to use my telekinesis, pick up this horde of zombies and throw them 15 feet <laughs> at them. <laughs> okay. I've never had the chance to do this yet. Roll. <laughs> she just throws a bunch oh, of no. bodies at it's one part of my, big so one. Part oh, of my that's class. right. It's part of, okay. This is, this is part of my she class. She just throws a bunch so... of zombies at one big one. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> so... I need to make a go to my actions and I need to make a I believe it's ba, 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 da, 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 telekinesis roll at that enemy. So I will target that enemy. Uh, here, let me clear that to make sure this goes right. Target. Target that with my telekinesis. Okay. So since I hit, they will both take my telekinetic damage. They both take <laughs> two, but more important, the one is thrown into the other, and the other's pushed back five feet. Forced movement, 2d4. Okay, so you do a total of five damage to both of them? So, it's, uh, yes, it's five damage to both of them. Okay. This one is thrown at that one, 
and mm -hmm. number two is pushed back one square okay. and forced movement incurs the spike growth yes Perigen, if you will Perigen, give me uh Perigen, muted joey 2d4 Perigen. all right he's not paying attention it's seven <laughs> all right you're probably muted, Joey. Probably. Or he walked away for a second. Possible. Or he's oh. reading a text again. Also possible. possible. Yeah. Uh, all right. All options. Johan that is my turn. <laughs> is gonna move right there. Uh. Let's see. Yeah. Range crossbow has a 30 and 120. So he's going to try to shoot these guys, but he's going to be at disadvantage because he's not as good with the crossbow. Uh, so he's going to try and shoot. Uh, let's see. He's going to try to go for the one that's closer to people. He's at disadvantage because he doesn't have crossbow expert or sharpshooter, whichever one it is that runs that. Uh, he's gonna hit though. Nice. That's the attack roll. I need the damage roll. I need it to land on the table, please. Thank you. Um, and he's going to do six damage. Uh, so that one just kind of, um, and then just continues lumbering forward. Um, getting hit by the crossbow. And he's going to reload. Uh, he's at disadvantage again. He's still too far of a range. He's going to hit again. Why at Vasilka? <laughs> hey! Stop. Hey! Yo! Just shooting all willy nilly. Oh, hey, hey, you're back. I'm back. Yeah, he is Did back. I miss something? I'm sorry. Yes. yes. Joey, can you can you announce when you're going somewhere? <laughs> yeah, that's that's fair. I um, yeeted the pile of zombies into your spike growth, uh, oh. pushing one back and I was calling for your damage, but I rolled for you and got seven. Okay. All well right. that's it. That's a good roll. Yeah. Yeah, so then he shoots it again and uh, and just continues lumbering forward. Uh, it is noticeably lumbering slower, um, but it's still lumbering. Erwin is gonna get up here. Uh, he is the same. He's going to try and shoot that zombie first at disadvantage. He's gonna hit i don't know what is happening with my um and he's going to end up shooting that one right dead center mass um and that one is going to fall forward um dead on the ground he's then going to take and go for the singular zombie left in the uh one horde Um, he is going to hit, and I don't even have to roll damage. Uh, he is then going to shoot that one as well, uh, center mass. And uh, that one will fall as well. All right. This zombie. Again, zombies aren't intelligent. Uh, Walk through the spike. Five, growth. ten. <laughs> Uh, 15. So I need three. Eight damage. I got you. Um. Hold on. Doing math because it's difficult. Uh. All right. Uh, what kind of. What kind of damage is spike growth? 
Uh, uh, piercing. piercing, piercing. I assume piercing. It is piercing, it, sir. It is magical because it's a spell. Magical mm -hmm. spikies. No, it, was, it wasn't for it that. It takes two d four piercing damage. Yep. Okay. Uh, so it is going to attack this one. Um, it is going to hit, uh, and do stop going off the table. Um, he is going to hit, uh, that guard. Where is he at? Um, and he's going to slash across his chest and this big old gash opens. Um, across the chest of the guard as he screams out in pain. Um, it's going to make a second attack with the claws. It's going to hit again. Uh, dang it. Mm. It's only going to do minimum damage. It's going to do two damage to him. And then it's going to make a third. A third? Jeez. Oof. And this time it's going to come in and attempt to bite. Oh no! And he is going to jab ah. his spear oh, in its mouth. Keep it away. The one rule of today's session, guys, was don't get bitten by anything. <laughs> don't get bitten. Um, yeah, it, com bit. it comes in and he, he gets, he stumbles back, but he sees it come in and just jabs it right and like pins its mouth open with his spear. Um... And he's just kind of holding this zombie at bay with a spear. It's a zombie too. Uh, <laughs> all right. Not you. Not you. What is happening? Five, 10, 15, 20. Here. 44. Is that four? Yeah, okay. Four. Nice. Yay. Wow. Uh, and as it gets about here, it th falls <laughs> to the ground. Um, Big zombies killed. And so at this point, DM, am I allowed to just drop concentration? Uh, yes, you are allowed to drop concentration on spell. Awesome. I drop concentration. Okay. All right, Vasilka. Maybe someday Vasilka will be able to do something. <laughs> she is going to double move up to here. Whoa. Zoom. She has a 30 foot movement, at double speed. She's speedy. Um, that is yeah. all she can do. Um, Esmeralda is just going to cast Firebolt at it because, again, this thing is at the point where it's low enough, at least as far as she can tell. Uh, yep, she's gonna hit it. Um, and she's going to do four damage. All right. That's her turn. Erjin. All right. Um, the only one who's been damaged is guard one, right? Uh, guard two took a bit. Guard one took a bit. Because guard one got attacked by the big zombie down here. Yeah. So guard one's taken a good chunk of damage and guard two took a good chunk of damage from friendly fire. Uh, I can only move up there. Um, well, you know what? Uh, I'll move up to here. Uh, but and I will target this guy and I will shoot a crossbow bolt. Yeah. All right. You hit. Nice. And yeah. All right. How Ooh. do you take down this zombie? 
Hmm. Well, there's a lot of people in the way. So, like... If, if the forehead were divided into four sections, it would be the very four of the forehead. It'll it just right into the dome. Okay. So just as he's kind of holding this thing at the end of his spear, trying to keep it from biting him, suddenly just a crossbow bolt goes right into it, and it just falls limp on his spear, and he just... <laughs> <laughs> uh, kind of as you <laughs> clear the uh zombies away i'm just i'm just gonna <laughs> real quick <clears throat> i apologize again <laughs> and it's, it's okay it happens I I will cast a single balm of the summer court on this one. Okay, uh, five to him. And one. That's not the right one. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh. Okay. Uh, seven. That's two. That's two bombs. Yeah, yeah, just six. I I pressed the wrong one. I'm sorry. Okay. And it gets so. a temporary. Look at that. And one temp. Hey, one temp. All right. Um. Thank you. I don't... These things just came out of nowhere. We were... I was off duty and suddenly the bells started going off and... We came outside and these things were just all over the place. They just appeared in the center of town? I don't... I, I don't know the whole story. The... The the bell rang. The, the, the alarm started sounding and... I, I was at home. I responded and... I walked outside and just saw the chaos and these things in the streets. Uh, gotcha, gotcha. Uh, uh, barkeepers, you should probably head back and guard your, well, building. Guards, I guess, come with us. Yeah, let's find where there are more of these. Huh? Um, roll persuasion. Persuasion. God damn it, I don't know if I'm all that good at that. I'm it's really not a high not. DC. This is a panic situation. Well, I got a zero. Um, like I said, not a high DC. Um, yeah. Civilian should not be out here fighting. This is insane. Go, go back inside. We're safe. I appreciate the help, truly, but. This is our job. You don't need to be out here. Technically, we're not civilians, so we'll help you guys. Well, we're like mercenaries, I guess, but you know, we're not yeah. going to yeah. money this time. I mean, if you want to give us money, we, 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 we wouldn't well, we object. Of money, we are helping. Wrong, but <laughs> we want to help. Um, Irina will step forward. They are good people. They are trying to help. Just let them help. Trust me. And they'll look at, who are you? Irina Kuliana, the daughter of the burgomaster of Rovia. And they'll kind of give her this look of like, why are you here? <laughs> um, and uh, she'll hold up her, her sword, which has the crest, her crest on it, um, of her family. And uh, we'll look at each other. Well, I guess if if they cause trouble, this is on you and your f family. Um, I understand. Now, let's go help. Um, and the uh, guards will now join you. Um, More Pokemon for us. <laughs> Uh, the NPCs, however, oh, the uh, <laughs> the family though will take Herogen's take advice. It up. Yes. Um, Stop it! And uh, <laughs> they will return to their bar uh, to uh, protect. Yeah. To well, also to make sure that you know people are are safe. We will. We will go back mm. to the bar, and we, or back to the bar. To the end, we will try to uh, protect it, and we will try to 
protect the people around. I'm trying to help them get to safety. Is there any place in this town that's safe right now? Um, the one, uh, one guard will turn and go. The church. The, the church does not seem to be affected at all. We're trying to get as many people there as we can. Um. Uh, right. We'll, we'll point people in that direction. Um. And with that, they will head back into their bar. And now, which way are you wanting to go? Are you going to head toward the west gate, where it seems to be the majority of people gathering? Or are you going to head to the east or the south, where it seems like lesser guards were going? I vote south. Hmm. South like will south take you toward south for like the square. Which south will that? take you down toward the town square and toward the Virgo Master's residence. Yeah, I'm cool with that. <laughs> yeah. All right. Um. You guys will. They will disappear. Um. Also, by hiding their numbers, is I can reuse maps if I need you. <laughs> um because let's be honest i didn't want to make 15 different city maps um i made enough of them but i didn't want to make that many it's a large city if i had to make a map for every like 10 feet of the city it'd be this ridiculously <laughs> long it'd be my, so much work <laughs> my chat's trying to kill me <laughs> Hi, yeah. you're welcome. Well, I, I I got it started. He did the spices. I wasn't doing the spices. Um, the spice. You made me in old bandage into a a stink Ugh. bug. Oh, oh no. Oh, you're welcome. That's okay. This next one will be fine. <laughs> <laughs> it's the pain that never ends. <laughs> Uh, Celtic, don't lump me in with your group. I gave her a regular bean, not a spicy bean. <laughs> um, oh, look at the hydration. Save yourself. <laughs> it's okay, Celtic. I got you. Of course I'm being nice, Celtic. <laughs> Let me refill my water as so I kill my taste buds. <laughs> you no. Know, uh -huh. <laughs> Tank notes. <laughs> what? A few minutes ago, I had like twenty k. So you know. <laughs> Actually, I need to refill my drink too. I'll be right back. Do we want to take like a five minute break or uh, something? Yeah, we can take a bio break. We'll take a bio break. Yeah, yeah. But I think a good time for a bio break while me.
Alright. <laughs> Someday, so I was like, I will have snack reading. I will get one. I actually ordered some of the super sour things. And they got lost by Amazon. So I don't have super sounds. I have to order them again. It was like a week. And then they're like, yeah, they got lost in the mail, sorry. Oh nice. It's like how did you how did that come? How did you lose that?
All right. I will have a snacker gene at some point. I just my stuff got lost in transit. All I'm right. Tower things. So I got to order more. All right. So as you guys come down here, uh, <clears throat> you see a very interesting scene. Uh, as you hear fighting happening down here. Um, and as you come down, you see a very familiar character uh, standing with two other guards. And what you notice is that all around them, um, leading up toward them, are several corpses and piles of these zombie creatures all around them. Um, are they on the map? They are. Or the south of us. I here. don't see I them. just brought up the map. I just sent you a map. From here to here? <laughs> I don't I see any don't tokens. Oh, I do. I do too. Huh? <laughs> they disappeared out of nowhere. Ah, they're there. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> okay, cool. Thank you. Continue, okay. the. Come and let uh, the weird guy die. So, yeah, as you guys come down here, you see just piles of zombies in the streets, uh, with a couple of the larger zombies dead already in the in the amongst the dead and amongst the piles. Um, you see Ezek with his demonic arm and, a, and his battle axe. You now see in full, uh, <clears throat> in full view is a massive battle axe. Um, that quite frankly looks way too big. Um, but you see to him, he's wielding this thing easily. Um, and is just slashing these zombies to pieces. Um, you see the two guards kind of flanking him. Uh, one of them looking pretty rough. Um, the other one looking barely phased at all. It looks like maybe the, the one who was hurt must have come um, down and, and they came up and reinforced, uh, gave him reinforcement uh, as the... Uh, the one on his left uh, looks very badly injured. Um, and uh, Ezek himself looks perfectly fine. Um, as he is just hacking through zombies in the streets. They are uh, the, th the uh, bigger zombies that are still in front of him uh, are just some of them are just barely hanging on. Um, they have chunks of them missing. Uh, and the one at his feet is just clean in half. Uh, the kind of hordes that look like they came up from behind um, that the guards have been dealing with are three or four zombies left as there's just dead all around them. I think uh, he might have this. <laughs> I you know, know I tend to agree with you. We might get hit as well. Oh, that's also true. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> kind of, the as you guys come up, the three guards kind of rush a little bit ahead. Um, and uh, the rush ahead do you need more help um, and uh, Ezek will uh, will turn to them 
No. Wait, that's not his voice. Hold on. Hey, his voice. His voice is down here. Down. There we go. There we go. There's his voice. <laughs> no. Go and help the others near the church. These are nothing. Um. And. Uh, he just turns back around and just continues to hack at the zombies in front of him. I think he's fine. I don't think he has it. How bad does the one guard look? Uh, guard two, you can visibly see just giant gashes across his chest. He has one arm that's, he's basically kind of like non-useful to his side. And he's just kind of swinging with all he can with one arm. Ask your wounds. Fuck it. I'll, I'll help a little bit. Cure oh, max touch. roll. Cure wounds is a touch. Oh, fuck it is, isn't it? Uh, mm -hmm. That's not the one I meant to say. Um, Healing work. Yeah, I don't or have that prepared. Balm. Oh, that <laughs> yeah, that's I'll expensive. give him a couple of balms instead. I could do a mass healing word if I need it. That seems overkill. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like this is a little excessive. Yeah, I'll give him a little bit. Make sure he he knows we're like we're here to help. That's that's all I'm doing. Okay, and he gets one tip, correct? Yep. All right. Uh, you see that his he like some of the bleeding stops, and he gets at least a little bit of use back in that one arm uh and kind of takes in a deep breath as he kind of blocks and cuts out another zombie um and he just kind of looks back to you and and nods and goes right back to fighting yeah that's fine no thanks necessary we'll go to the church <laughs> <laughs> um so to the church all right you guys are yeah, heading towards the church let's go all right let me grab they he rolled really well and the zombies did not i rolled Good. to see how he would be doing and he rolled incredibly well to compare <laughs> to the zombies the zombies just cool they didn't, we like, didn't want to have them anyway they did I like really, one did not, damage, no, two damage. Meanwhile, he was doing like 17, 20. I was like, what are you doing? He was critting left and right. It was hilarious. I was like, okay, it's a good thing that you're not angry with them right now because I can't miss with you, apparently. That's a bad thing. <laughs> He was like I was with the hags. I was doing the same thing with him. I just couldn't miss. <laughs> um, but he's also mm -hmm. why it was taking so stinking long to do my prep for that map was because of him. <laughs> Dang it, Isaac. I kept giving <laughs> more enemies being like, let me just do some like, damn, let, <laughs> they, let things hit him. He's not hard to hit. Just hit him. Nope. Nope. No damage. No. Just I'm nothing. It's like, thanks. All right, to the church or to the gate? Uh, uh, church. Yeah. He says that people need help at the church. Yeah. We might as well do as he says for now. I suppose. Who knows? A group of people meeting up in a church, it might draw some more attention from the zombies and possibly vampire. Which, by the way, we haven't seen any since they stormed into the inn. That kind of worries me. I think we should be grateful that there were more zombies than there were vampires, probably. Mm -hmm. Fair. Fair. Neither are good, but one is easier to kill than the other. Okay. Oh, sure. Okay. I get really annoyed that these don't line up exactly <laughs> with my map. And it irritates it's fine. me. 
All right. This one. Oh, those are burning buildings. Hmm. You will be able to see the name of as oh. you so are here. Um, I need to move you guys back just a little bit because you're coming up the street. Mm-hmm. Uh, what is your marching order? I'm just kind of throwing you up here. What is the order in which you I'm guys come? The front I'm fine with that. I want to be in the front area. Couple of I'd be lagging cars. behind because sleepy. <laughs> okay. Uh, I know I'm not exhaustion too yet, but you know what? If you're giving me exhaustion, I'm going to play exhaustion. So You're fine. Nothing wrong with that. Um, the, little, the symbol in the church. That's fun. I like it. Well, I had to denote the church somehow. Uh, <laughs> the rest support this, and so do I. <laughs> and, uh... I've got 35 move speed. I imagine I'd be, like, behind, uh... Same. I'm also behind my move speed, so... Oh, yeah. well, then I'd definitely be behind DeRosta instead. <laughs> oh, I already am. Sorry, I just turned <laughs> yeah, on the map. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to get these things thrown on here real fast. Uh, go away, go away, go away. I don't need Ezek and his minions here now. Go away. Go away. Okay. Uh, okay, that's that one. And okay. Sorry, I have to organize things. Um. All right. Uh, so as you guys are kind of, you come running up the street. Um, you begin to hear a <clears throat> a bunch of noise coming from by the church. Um, but in general, there is not a ton of fighting noise um you just hear a bunch of different sounds um That's a mixture a of different monster noises um and what you will see as you come up is um there are a few vampire as well as several zombies. Um, all standing a distance from the church. But not getting any closer. Um, they seem to all just be there. Um, you see a few of the different, uh, uh, you see a couple of the, come on, the, uh, Velaki guards, uh, all, there we go. 
You see a couple of the Velaki guards standing, uh, like weapons at the ready. You see just a few of them, uh, standing there with weapons at the ready, and <coughs> nothing seems to be happening. It's almost like it's a stare down, uh, between these guards and the zombies. To clarify, this building here is the church. Yes. The one with the uh, symbol. Hey, good, good morning, <laughs> Lord. Symbol yep, on it's the symbol yes. of the morning, Lord. Yes. Okay. Um. So, what are you guys... Right now, you're not in combat yet. As you guys run up here, what are you guys doing as you approach? I would like to ready in action. Okay. I would like to ready a... I, 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 I want to attack when we make the deci decision one way or another. If we decide to attack, I attack immediately. That's my ready to action. How do the guards look? The ones in front of the church? Yeah. Uh, they look a little battered, but they don't look really injured by any means. Um, these guards also look to be <laughs> as best as one can be in this world. Seem to be more decorated. They seem to be a little bit nicer equipment. Um, so you imagine they might be more veteran uh, than the average guard, which could be why they were the ones tasked with charging, with protecting this important uh, building. Um, but they look a little battered, like just physically tired from the fight. But they don't seem to be really injured by any means. Gotcha. How how does everyone in the party look? Has anyone been touched yet? No. Uh, <laughs> you took damage. I hurt myself. <laughs> yeah, Mikael oh, hurt I himself. A little bit. Uh, uh, I can't a couple of the a couple of the guards are a little in, hurt. Um, like not much. In the Sorry. time, <laughs> in the time to run I over here. I the seven. He's fine. Harrison. Um, yeah. You don't have temp currently, right? No. In the time to run over, my barrier would have recharged. So. Get your six back from me. Awesome. Right. So are you are effectively a max uh, uh, yeah. There don't there do not appear to be any uh, civilians outside of the church that are alive. Well, the problem is that they're blocking the church for people who need to go into the church, so we need to get yeah, rid of them. Yeah, that was my thought. I would imagine, right? Yeah. 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 Do there appear to be any civilians on our side looking towards the church? Like, No, uh, there zombies? are none from the where you are coming. There are no s survivor civilians outside of the church that are still alive. There are several dead bodies littering the... the uh, walkway up here. Uh, but there are none that are living that are still out, save for these three guards. Well, let's take these guys out. Yeah, let's okay. take them out. DM. <laughs> All right. I'm going to need initiative. Okay. My, my ready after we do initiative. <laughs> Yes, we initiative. will resolve your action. Yay! Okay, let's see Can here. Ooh, 18 out of 17! Oh. Fuck yeah! <laughs> That's crazy. Nice. Mikael, I just noticed you <laughs> that one. It Oof. was on a 19, and then it rolled. Oh, no. It was loaded on the 19. Yeah. Zofi can go earlier now. Look at you go. Woo! 
Uh, Esmeralda yet again at the top of the list. <laughs> Esmeralda. Oh hey. my god, Esmeralda. Hey. All the time. Vasilka went up a few slots too. <laughs> yes. She's not at a one anymore. Look at her wow, go. Wow, look at her go. <laughs> uh, es Esmeralda has a plus four to initiative. Fancy. Um, cool. Okay. Plus three. It's not that impressive. I mean. She rolled a natural 20. <laughs> I'm oh. sure she did. Yeah, I just can't roll for shit. That's the issue I have. So, yeah. Um. Uh. So, at that, Esmeralda is the first to go in turn order. But Zila, you said yeah. you wanted to attack. Yeah. Am I targeting him? Hold on. Uh. No. No. Eh. That one. Okay, I got him. All right. And boom! And it's a miss! No, it's a hit. Wait, it's a hit! Hell yeah! <laughs> um, so, again, it's just gonna be daggers because she's not feeling good. So, mm -hmm. um, hold. Let me find it. There it is. Boop! And then. A boop! Yay! Now. Real quick, with rampaging power, if it is, uh, you could add just uh, uh, once on each of your turns. Does that count with a ready to action? No, not technically, because it's not your turn, <laughs> technically. Okay. Follow up question. Um, if you dealt damage during your last turn, your rampage rampage die goes becomes a d6, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. Does it go up automatically? Not on a ready to action like this, no. Okay, cool. Um, okay, yeah, that's my ready to um, action. Yay! Question: Your oh, your projectile weapon deal force damage. That's right. Yep, force damage. Uh, which is so strange to me. They should, I feel like they should do the damage of the weapon, but that's how the mechanic works. So that's how it is. It's I fine. mean, if it really matters. <laughs> well, no, I we just could say it's force slashing or whatever. It doesn't really matter. I just feel like it, you know, if you're attacking with a sharp weapon and it's a physical weapon, it's yeah, weird that, that it makes would sense. Just not do a slash. It just does force. Yeah, that's me. But yeah. that it's how the class works. So that's how it. That's how it is. Just gonna, I'll go with it. That's how the class. Cool, works. cool. Um. Okay. Esmeralda's turn. Yep. What's she gonna do? Um, let's see. She's going to get to there. Uh, cause she wants to actually be able to hit things this turn. At this time. Um... Hmm. What would be a good one for you to do? Honestly, your best one would probably be Magic Missile. Just hit as many of them as you can. Although Firebolt does more damage. The average more damage. Uh, we'll do... Uh, let's see. Magic Missile. High level. If you cast it at a higher level, you'd be good. Let's do a higher level. So she's gonna cast it at a fourth level. So she'll get an extra three. Um so there's three and then one, two, three. She's going to uh I need to make her target a person. She's gonna target that same one that your action just went off on. Cool. And then one, two, three. Mm. She's gonna hit it for 15 damage. Uh, and blow a big hole right in the center mass. Uh, as it just kind of, she basically lines them up in a shot and just <laughs> right through. Uh, <laughs> just kind of just blows this giant hole right right in the gut um 
or what used to be the gut of this zombie. Uh, bear in mind, the same thing applies. The two strat ones are singular. The other four are horde type, and then the two vampire spawn. All right. And that is all she can do on her turn. So, Zila. Hmm. I want to have fun. Hold on a second. Okay. 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 I imagine one of you wants to get up there fast. Looks at Mikhail, Derosta, Irina, and Vasilka for this. Yeah, I like I to be close. Myself. I'm pretty fast. <laughs> um, but I'm not that. I'm normal fast. <laughs> I don't have any sorts of ranged weapons, so I kind of need to be close. And then, how does Vasilka react? <laughs> um, Vasilka just kind of puts up her hands, <laughs> like this is what I got. <laughs> Okay. Okay. So with that in mind, now it's between Irina and Vasilka. I'm gonna give Vasilka haste. <laughs> mm. Okay. Boink. <laughs> she now has haste. Um, that's my action. So um. I I don't think I need to link it, but there you go. Uh, how do I do I target her? I think so. Yeah, target her and then cast it. Am I targeting her? Boo? Yep. Hey, I see it. Cool. <laughs> okay, let's buff the equivalent of a barbarian. Yeah. That's a great idea. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so that was three side points. And then... Um, hold on. What What's going on here? I don't know. Oh, I, there you go. I can't. Yeah, okay. you can. I'd, 5, I'd... 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. And then uh, bonus action, create more daggers because that's what we're going to play with today. And that's my turn. All right. Vampire spawn. It, hearing this happen next to it, is going to whip around and charge up uh, to Esmeralda. Um, and is going to hmm, attack her. It's going to miss this first and it's second. So it tries to take swipes at her, and she just kind of steps to the side, kind of dodging out of the way as it attacks. Um, doesn't do anything. The next vampire spawn, also going to go up to Esmeralda. Um, and is going to attempt to attack her. Why did it attack the vampire spawn? That was not what you're supposed to target. You're supposed to target Esmeralda. <laughs> you miss. I'm sure Doesn't 11 matter. still misses. Also miss. So once again, as this one comes up, she kind of sidesteps out of the way. As if she's done this a time or two. <laughs> um, imagine that. Sort of thing. Um... The kind of two or three 
uh, guards are kind of up here. Uh, which one is this one? Okay, you need to be guard three. Just so I can keep track of which one's which. Um, he is. Let's see. Okay, he will take a five foot step forward. Um, seeing that there's help here now, um, and he's going to target this horde. Uh, with. The notable, other notable difference of these ones is that they have the giant pikes. Um, mm. so they have a reach, and they hit, and he swipes um, with the giant pike, uh, and cleaves one of them and chops the other one off at the legs, making a crawler. Um, I'm out! Anyway. And that's his turn. Zofi. Uh, let's see. We'll scoot up to here and do a good old not Eldritch Blast on Vampire Spawn 2. Okay. Do, 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 do. Hey, all right, great, cool, eventful turn. I miss. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah, right. yep, <laughs> yep. Um, okay, it's hard to see on this map. But right here is technically still able to be walked through. You can kind of see the debris there. It's going to be rough terrain there. Um, I should have cleaned up the smoke a little bit to make it a little bit more noticeable. It didn't look quite as covered in the map builder. Um, so just enough of a reference here is that this area here is still walkable. It's not part of the building. It's just rough terrain because of the broken pieces of the buildings. Um, but this guard is going to come up here and is going to attack uh, this vampire spawn and he's going to miss. And that's his turn. Thrusta. All right, I'm running up five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five. Can I go there? Mm-hmm. Because I can't go past there because it's rough terrain and that guy went my way. Okay. I would like to do a dual cast, I think. Do that. Okay. And I want to do Word of Radiance to the two Vampire Spawns at a bonus action level. Okay. Target them. They both succeed. Dang it. Okay. So nothing happens to them with that. I don't think okay. so. Yeah. But then I'm going to attack one with two attacks. So. Okay. I'll attack the one that's on my left and like down for me by one. Okay. Vampire one. This one. Yeah. <laughs> Bring out my little short sword, it's magical. Okay. Great. I 
attack. That one misses. Okay. That is my turn. All right. This guard. Um. He is going to kind of take a more defensive stance and he's going to turn to the other one. And apparently listen to an eagle caw in the distance. <laughs> I was about to say the background. I had to sit there and think for a second, like, did I did I hear that? Uh, yeah. Okay. I love it. I, all right. Didn't realize the song had that in there, but okay. It works. Scream! Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, right. I don't have that on the soundboard. Um, and he's going to look to the other one. Do not go too far. If we go too far, we want to be protected. Um, and he is going to basically... <coughs> thank you. There it is. Um, yeah, no problem. I got you. <laughs> And he is just going to basically kind of plant himself and the spear um, pointed out, taking a defensive stance. Got number three. Uh, he is going to go here and attempt to attack this vampire spawn. Add advantage. And he's going to hit. And he's got a double handed. Why to Irina? You're not targeting Irina. What's with you in targeting the he's random not, people? He's not targeting that, though. His targeting literally says vampire spawn two. That's weird. That's weird. And yet it's just targeting whatever creature it decides to target. Irina very briefly feels a, uh, <laughs> has a neck spasm. Like, ah! <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, speaking of Irina, her turn now. Uh, she is going to get it right here. Uh, doesn't have advantage, unfortunately. But she can still hopefully attack. Um, excuse me. All right. Please. Uh, cause I don't, she doesn't have a shield. I don't think. I'm double checking that. I don't think we gave her a shield, did we? Oh, I don't she does have think a shield. So. She does have a shield. Does she? she can't use oh, it. Okay. She can't use the long sword two handed. She has to use the one. She's gonna miss. Wait, but, but, but. Precision? No. What she can do. And dot no. What can she do? <laughs> um. Rally? <laughs> no, well, rally is temp. Precision is extra to hit. Yeah, so she doesn't have precision, Aaron. at least currently. What she does have, though, is the ability to forgo her second attack. And oh. use Commander Strike. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, and she is going that. to... Oh. Basically, in the opening that she creates by having the thing dodge, she's going to tell uh, Esmeralda to attack it. Um, using the superiority die. So she's going to do that. Esmeralda has her rapier, so she's going to attack with the rapier. 
and she will hit. Um, and she will do her damage, which is abysmal, but she also gets the damage from the superiority die. Mm -hmm. As it. Mm -hmm. So we're going to roll a d8. Because that's what she has right now. And we're going to add another six damage on top of it. Hell yeah. Okay. Um, so in the end, not a terrible turn. Yeah. Um, He's doing it. All right? Yeah. All things considered, <laughs> she's done far worse turns. Bad. Yeah. Um, yeah. Now, Strahd Zombie. Um, yeah. It's gonna lumber its way up to the guard number three. And it's going to have advantage just simply because it was the closest creature in its walking range. It's going to hit the guard. And it's going to do three damage. And it's going to do its second attack. At advantage once again. Gonna hit. And do another uh, six damage. Uh, where is guard three? Why am I missing him in my. And then he's going to do his third attack, because the straw zombies have three. And this is going to be another bite. And you see he lunges at the guard. And the guard falls underneath the weight of the Strahd zombie as it just begins to rip and tear into him. Uh, mm. And guard number three falls. Oh, shit. Oh, no. <laughs> He's unconscious. Ha! Oh, it can be saved. Okay. Mm. Ah! <laughs> uh huh. Mm -hmm. Ah. <laughs> mm -hmm. Sure, yes. Saved. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And this horde Surely. is going to come up here. And... It's going to... Take a second move. It's action. And come up here. Guard number two, seeing his friend just get killed, is going to literally... Well, <laughs> as far as he's aware, he's dead. <laughs> um, he is going to quite literally sprint. Thematically, he's just charging at these zombies. Um, with his spear an advantage two natural ones oh, oh my god buddy, oh, buddy. impressive oh, that is incredible you know what did he charge into that wasn't the you zombies, know what though. he's neil okay <laughs> makes sense he went he goes charging in and he goes oh. to go like he's just He's angry. He's enraged. He sees his friend get a attacked and, and, as far as he knows, killed by the zombie. Um, 
<laughs> and th he goes just running blindly at them. Um, and he goes to hit them. And as he goes to hit, he... They basically just... <clears throat> almost unluckily for him, he goes right between several of them and ends up in the horde itself. Oh, which is going that's to not good. Give them an, a singular attack. Uh, which one is this one? This is one. Now, mechanically, he's outside the horde. Thematically, he ended up inside the horde. Uh, I'm just going to jump back to them because that's the easiest way to do this. And they're going to miss him somehow. Somehow. Okay. Hey! <laughs> Come on, guard he, two. Yeah. As he he um, realizes where he's at, he jumps back out of the way just as they okay. try nope. <laughs> to attack him. Um and oh, manages yeah. to get himself out of there and and get the spear ready. Um Wow, he got lucky. Okay. This zombie horde. They're not intelligent. Is going to come up here. And this guy here is going to get an attack of opportunity. Because he has reach. Uh, there you are. And he is going to swing. And as the zombies move out of the way, Jesus. he stumbles and falls five feet <laughs> into the next square. My God. How many net ones have we seen in the past second? <laughs> Ooh. Three. Three Two net ones. That's incredible. Between that is two incredible. creatures. Well, it, it, overall tonight, yeah. there's been a lot of that ones. But, there's been yeah. a lot of that ones. Y'all, yeah. <laughs> I'm the one dealing with exhaustion, man. Uh -huh. Um, but I'm next. God damn that it. That is all that <laughs> horde can do. So, Erjin, you're up. Oh, God, hold on. Oh. Sorry, I was playing with my cat. Um, all right. We are looking at everyone's looking pretty healthy, except for guard three, who is possibly is dead. Maybe dead. Maybe. Mm -hmm. to yeah. Totally not a zombie. Yep, yep. Yeah. Yeah. Yep, yep. Yeah. Um, what, what are we looking at here? 20 to that That's corner even, to you? that corner. Hmm. <laughs> Concerning. Actions. What do I have for spells? Okay. Uh, you said. What'd you say? Uh, I said okay. Perry. Perry. Oh, Perry. Perry. The platypus. Perry, the Perry. Platypus. It's like Perry the platypus. Perry the platypus. Okay, sorry. Continue. Um. Hmm. You know, I'm feeling like I'm just gonna. Yeah, we'll just move up to wait. Hold on. That was there. Yeah, we're going to move here and uh, thematically, I would have been casting Shillelagh as we were running through. It's a cantrip, so that's fine. I'll allow it. Gonna target Horde 1. Thank you. Only DM. because you knew that you were going to be going into another battle. So I'll allow it because you're kind of. Yeah. Oh, thank mm. God. That was a hit. Thank God. All right. Give it's it a, a Horde. Good they don't have great AC. There's a lot of them. Yeah, that's <laughs> true. That's true. Um, you have an advantage roll again to make sure you don't yes. crit. Also, a very good point. Very good. That's why I moved there. <laughs> <laughs> All right. 
Cool, 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 cool. This is with the Gulfiest staff. Now, how does this work again? Uh, you can expand Okay, so I can regain six damage. You know what? I'm gonna expend a charge and uh, suck up their life force with the Gulf Gul Gulfiest oh, staff. Oh, you're gonna use the thing you haven't used. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, I mean, why not? Why not? I guess so describe what you think this looks like. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, In this fight with zombies and vampires. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, it doesn't, it doesn't specify it has to be a certain thing. Yeah, it's just hit, hit a thing, gain health back. Um... As, as best as it could be described, I just go up and bonk them all on the head. I, I, you know, I mean, I did what? Six damage, so that'd be three zombies. I just go up and knock three zombies on the top of the head and they just fucking fall. Do you Rafiki, do you Rafiki bonk them? Rafiki bomb? Bonk? Oh, come on, even I know that. I'm sorry. Lion King? I'll put Rafiki? it in me. Oh, that's the name of the monkey, I assume? Yeah, yeah exactly. Yes. I know exactly what you're talking about. Yes. I haven't seen Lion King since I was like six. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. That. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that, that wasn't the exact scene I was thinking of. But yes, exactly. <laughs> Give three swift bonks to the head and knock him on dead. Okay. Uh, I need a wisdom saving throw. From me? Yep. Uh, oh, God. Well, I'm a wisdom caster, so surely this won't go bad. Saving throw? Mm hmm. Okay. How much has to say it? Oh boy. <laughs> You're kidding! You're kidding! Nah! I call bullshit! Okay. <laughs> That's amazing. That's that bullshit. is so good! That's bullshit. Am I, I gonna become part that... vampire, part zombie? What the I fuck? will die into existence. Oh my god, I'm getting raided and followed. Hello, everyone. Hi, raiders. You... I just rolled that one. <laughs> I need you to roll me a D100. Uh, oh, cool. Right. That's fun. A five. Uh, That's great, right? Either very good or very bad. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> or very random. Yeah. You are paralyzed. Oh, motherfucker. Very bad. Hmm. <laughs> uh, no, no. Is that you? No. You. No. <laughs> so no, you. Haven't swallowed yet. So we got time. Specifically. To uh, you retreat into your own mind and become paralyzed. Oh no, that's not oh. good. I retreat into my own mind. Do I live in like a, my own mind landscape or am I just talking to myself? You can choose which way it works. But regardless, you are paralyzed. That's fair. Um, do I still gain the six hit points back? Yes, you do gain the benefit. Awesome. Great! That, that does I'm paralyzed function. at max health. Let's go! <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! All right. <laughs> Excuse me. All right. This zombie horde is going to move here. And is going to take... Oh, I did say he fell into that square, so he is technically prone. You did say that. Yep. I did explicitly state he... Uh, fell into that. So, yep. What the... Oh. This is fine. All right. Yeah. Uh, fine. Let's see. A grown creature 
Apparently, it's not just us with an Nat advantage. once tonight. <laughs> oh, must be oh. one of the nights for it. Uh. Uh, and he is going to slam down where they are. Um, are going to kind of crowd around him and and uh, start clawing at him. Good for him, you know. And <laughs> do a chunk of damage. Uh, it's hard to tell exactly how much. Uh, and then uh, as they kind of retreat back and turn to start looking, you see a splayed body on the ground um, of the guard. All right, this horde. Uh, it's gonna go there. And oh, that's dirty. Can't go that far. Uh, so it's gonna get here, and that's all farther it can go. Uh, cause well, it could double move, and they are stupid, so it's gonna double move. No. <laughs> um. All right. Next, big zombie. It is going to move through its allies. And it's going to get to here because rough terrain. Uh, but it is within range of guard one. Now this zombie does not look great. However, he may be dead depending on how well guard one rolls his uh, reaction. So let's see. Guard one hits, but does he do enough damage to kill it? Come on, guard one. Hmm. Uh, why are you targeting zombie horde two? That should go to this drawed zombie. He. Never mind, it does not do enough damage. Um, hmm. I was looking at the wrong character. Uh, so he is going to attack the guard. First attack. Ooh. Yeah, first attack, he's going to miss. And he's going to hit Zombie Horde too. Cool. Second attack. He's gonna miss. Third attack? He's gonna hit. No. So he's going to lunge Ow! at him uh, to try to take and take a nibble. And he's gonna do three damage. Cool. Effectively two, because he had a single hit point of temp. Um, from the Silka the, Smash time? Uh, yes, it is now time for the Barbarian, who can now move <laughs> 60 feet on her turn. The Silka Smash And hasten! She gets, a, she gets to attack twice! Smash <laughs> extra and She fast. already had multi-attack. So she gets to attack again? <laughs> so she gets three attacks. Which is just stupid <laughs> with her... Okay, I see how this is going to go. Yeah. 5, 10, 15, yes. 20, 25. of what I have to deal with. 30. <laughs> Fucking y'all. Basilka smash. Uh, she's going to hit these. I don't think she can miss. 
Oh, um, thank God. Nice. She's going to pummel it, and then she's going to get her second attack. <laughs> she's going to hit, and she's going to pummel it. And she's going to yeah. just... She just <laughs> runs in and just smashes these zombies, like... Just image. comes in and just <laughs> yes. punches Incredible. down, smashes their heads, punches Jeez, straight like, through several of them. You are. Um, Good it, job, Vasilka. Okay. She... Mm she this has is going to work. <laughs> yep. And the barbarian's going to, and she still has movement. Uh -huh. <laughs> She's going to come over here. Mm -hmm. And now attack this zombie horde with her third and final. And she's going to hit because she literally can't miss, I think, unless she takes a one. And she's going to hey! wipe out that horde. <laughs> Woo! Giving her haste was the best decision I have ever made. <laughs> glorious decision. Um, Zila will say, good job, Vasilka. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, she is going to look back at you and just kind of like, kind of nod. Roll me an insight check. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Insight check at disadvantage. Let's see here. That, that's a one. <laughs> Can't read her. Oof. Yeah, I'm 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 off. <laughs> hey, I did tell my chat that I am going to roll in that one here soon. So <laughs> you're right. I was right. <laughs> Thank you for okay. making me Got roll it, it there. <laughs> Guard two is going to attack this horde that is in his reach, and going to crit. Okay, well, it's almost your turn. Maybe someday. And do 12 damage <laughs> uh, to that horde. So he's going to he's going to swing the, the pike. Um, uh, and uh, end up chopping down about six of the uh, zombies in the horde. Cool. Um, and that is his turn. Mikael. Wow. <laughs> Mikael, okay. we go. One, two, three, four, five. Can I move up that much with the difficult terrain? It doesn't start difficult until that spot there, so you're still yeah. good there. Cool. I'm going to hit the big fellow. All right. Max. Sorry, I have my stuff. Power. Okay. Do let's see damage. Hell yeah. Woo! Oh, let's see that right. one. And then I'm attacking the horde next to it with my second attack. Alright. Nice. Oh, oh shit, my god. Double one. Oh, actually, Minimum. hold on. I need to bring that strong zombie back. Hold on. Uh, why? <laughs> yeah, it's a zombie, of course. It has the, you know, the zombie if, thing. If it lived, then I'm I want to have attacked it still. with that one instead of the second horde. Yeah, I'll, what I'll do is I'll, we'll see if it lives. Okay. The uh, con save, what is it, five plus seven. exceeding? Uh, yes. Uh, so I need, uh, and you exceeded it by three, so it has to roll a 13. Eight plus, okay. Isn't it? Okay. Am I wrong on that? I don't remember offhand. I don't remember though. <laughs> I think it's, or no, it is, I need, actually, I need to double check that. Let me look at the sheet. Yeah, I... Offhand, uh, I think I it's five. Zombies, I, I think it's five plus exceeding damage. But five plus I don't damage know that taken. For sure. Uh, well, regardless, damage. it's dead because it rolled a seven oh. and needed an eight. Cool. Oh. Nice. 
So the other one did take minimum damage. So the other damage. one did take the seven I damage. I get minimum damage on the other one. <laughs> yeah. Cool. All right. Anything else? Uh, nope. That's my turn. All right. Top of the round, Esmeralda. You're going to attack the vampire spawn with your rapier. And you get multi attack. And she's gonna crit. Hey, yo. Let's go. And almost roll max damage. <laughs> she rolled 20 out of a possible 21 damage. Nice. Uh. And she gets to roll her second attack. Doesn't crit, but it does hit. And rolls minimum damage. There we go. It happens. <laughs> Perfectly balanced, as all things should be. Yeah. Um, <coughs> yes. And that is her turn. <coughs> Zila. Don't die, Chris. <clears throat> I need some water. <clears throat> Then go get some. Hmm. Interesting, 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 interesting. Um. So I'm, if, I'm imagining Vampire Spawn 2 is not looking very good right now. Um. Roll perception. Oh, come on. <laughs> All right. <laughs> They're undead. It's hard to tell exactly. You need to be able to see if you can pick it out. Oh man, that sucks. Um, Aww. from what you can tell, it's still looking pretty healthy. Cool. All right. Um, what am I going? What am I going to do? I think. Uh, let me see here. Okay. Loki, I'm kind of vibing out to this music right now. It's a good vibe. That is a pretty good vibe, isn't it? I'm not um, dying anymore. So... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Please hold. Holding. Uh, thank you, Tank and I. Um... Yeah. I am, yeah, I'm just going to do the um, telekinetic weapons, and I'm going to do multiple, so I'm going to do all three. So that would be one, so it's, ah, hold. Let me Still read holding. what this says. For each additional side point spending, you can fling an additional weapon. So if I do two of them, two side points, I can fling all three. Is that what I'm understanding? Okay, read that again. Uh. <laughs> okay. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Welcome to what I have to read, guys. <laughs> mm -hmm. Um... You can telekinetically fling a weapon at a creature, so that's just base. If I want to send do multiple i do additional side points so if i want to fling all three of the created daggers i have it's two side points yes yes all right because of my free side point it's that okay so i'm gonna be flinging three of them i'm gonna start with <sighs> gosh i don't know I'm gonna start with. Honestly, I'm gonna start with the big boy. Why is it saying Harrigan? What in the world? Welcome to my life. Don't target me. No, the the thing was coming from you. I don't know. It was weird. Uh... Anyway. Um. So now I attack. Well, bam. That's one. I'm going to go ahead and do the damage. Boom. Nice. And I'm going to go ahead and tack the um, rampage on that that one since 
you know, anyways, get that out of the way. Oh, that balances it out. That's nice. All right. So that's one attack. Uh, same target. Uh, that hit. Mm -hmm. That's the second attack. And then this is the third. And a boop. Nice. Um, so that's all three. And then bonus action, replenish my daggers. That's my turn. Alrighty. Why don't we call it here? Since we only have about 20 minutes till D's heart cut off. This is not going to be resolved in 20 minutes. <laughs> And yep. then I mean, if we're, we're, if we're them pretty good. I mean, <laughs> I think this will be a good place to stop. The then DM knows on, what more is to yeah, come. I was we about do. to yeah. say, put it on. That's why yeah. I was saying, put it on the vampire yep. spawn so that I don't have another. As much as I would <laughs> love to have another turn freely <laughs> given. <laughs> yeah. Uh, but no, I think this is a good place to stop. Um. Have a good night, Celtic. Um. Yep. Night, Celtic. Uh. Yeah. I don't wish to. Uh. Go too long, cause I know that this won't get wrapped up in twenty minutes. <laughs> yeah. So let's no. stop this place. This is a good. Pl yeah. This yeah. is a good place to stop. <laughs> we'll start. Oh, start combat again next time. With. What? Are you, what did you message me? Uh, I messaged you the name of the song that you were vibing out to. Oh, thank you, thank. Mm -hmm. I big preach. Uh, I'm gonna go raid Neil because. No. I'm gonna go raid. I'm gonna raid out. I'll be back. Alrighty. <laughs> thank you for watching. Appreciate all of you. We're gonna raid out to Nial, Vincent and Shrouded. He's also a player in our uh, Terrandale campaign, which I imagine we'll be playing next week. So, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye! <laughs>